Good evening, everybody. How are we? I hope you've all had a cracking weekend. And um, well, I decided to sneak on the track for just a couple of minutes and put in a really blindingly good lap on San Quan. And guess what? I crashed. And I crashed. And I crashed. And I crashed a bit more. Um, this is going to be horrendous tonight. And I apologise profusely to everybody that I hit this evening. Um, this is not a track that I know, and it is not a track that I'm going to learn very quickly. And um, I'm worried, very worried. But there we go. But anyway, I hope you've all had a cracking, cracking weekend. I had a good weekend. Uh, Joe and Lauren were away. So Saturday, I spent quite a fair bit of time in the daily races. And I have inched my DR up by about two pixels. Um, despite a win. Yes, we had a win in the daily races. Not only was it a win, it was a clean race as well. And yeah, really good. Set me up. I was really, really up for some more racing later in the evening. And then the evening, it was totally different. It was a complete punt fest. There were all sorts of shenanigans going on. Um, and I have got a video coming out tomorrow of the weirdest penalty that you are ever likely to see. Yes, I got punted, not deliberately, not deliberately. It was an innocent um, guy outbraked himself, it was purely innocent. But I got the penalty for kicking him off the track. So be warned, somebody can hit you and you can get the penalty. <laughs> all good fun, all good fun. Um, yeah, interesting video, that one. So tonight, um, the randomizer is still in bits at the moment because I spent the weekend playing the game rather than working on the randomizer. And I'm trying to build in this new module that is going to manage uh, the new way that we're going to be working the allocation of the races. So in other words, what I want to do is use the randomizer to choose the race at the end of the stream for the next day and then pre-publish um, what we're going to be doing. So what we're going to be doing tonight is Sanqua 12, I think it's 10 laps actually. Are we doing 10 laps? We're we doing 12 laps, eight laps. It's eight laps. I've got to get it right. Uh, eight laps of San Qua, And then I think it's four laps um, of San Qua. That is basically preparation for the Super Touring Car Championships that we're going to be doing on Friday. And I think something might have just crashed because everybody is leaving. Um, I'm going to cover that off in just a moment because there were lots of people in the room and then suddenly everybody's disappeared. Either that or nobody loves me anymore. So I'm thinking it crashed. Um, so I've got Jack, Speedy, Gazelle, Tom, loads of people. Come to that in just a moment. Uh, so we're going to be doing San Qua, um, the feature race and the um sprint race then we're going to be heading off to um major west reverse in the group b b cars uh then we've got a couple of um favorite races to do and then we'll finish up on the nord slifer that is the idea and just as i had suspected the server has now crashed um so let me see what we can do and Whoa, that is a big old crash. That's. Can you guys still hear me on YouTube? I'm hoping you can. OBS is still running. Um... The suspension setup is incorrect, so I need to modify that as well. Um, it was put together very, very quickly just a short while ago. Um, but what I am going to do is I'm going to go for a complete reboot on my PlayStation because that is. That is not clever, not clever at all. Um, Jack, can you let me know what the suspension settings need to be in the um, in the lobby and I'll get them. I'll get them sorted out. Um, forgive me, guys. The uh, um, Gran Turismo has crashed. My PlayStation was fine, but I'm doing a complete reboot on the PlayStation just to be sure. Um, I don't know if anybody else has been having problems with the lobbies today. Mad Mike, it's all suspension. I thought that's what I had. Maybe not. Maybe not. 
maybe not because i have changed the lobby a little bit i'm using my old daily c uh, no the daily a lobby um the other thing to uh, if i can just mention is run raisin is in the discord lobby chat at the very bottom of the list of all of the lobby stuff uh, in in discord at the very very bottom there is a um, chat facility where people can talk um over chat and um he is in there if you would like to join him i'm sure that he will be more than happy we did just do a very very quick check with it to make sure that everything was all okay it does seem to be um i won't be in the chat because i have a million other things to contend with and being deaf i can't have two sets of audio so you know one for the game and the other one for the chat in my other ear i'm going to sneeze in a moment i think i've got a cold coming um Yeah, I'm hoping the lobbies are going to be sorted out. As I said, I'm just doing, as you can see, a complete reboot on the PlayStation just to rule out anything. Um, I haven't used it at all today. I don't know what other lobbies have been like. Something went wrong. Oh, this is not looking clever, is it? Has anybody else been having any problems with Gran Turismo today? Ride height and toe angle. OK. Body height, all suspension, toe in, toe out camber. Yeah, I'm having some um, issues with Gran Turismo right now. Game of Dan, been on almost all day getting my AS again and not one issue with GT7. Uh, show me I've actually rebooted the whole of my PS5. College of Tom's had a disconnection to the server while doing a time trial. And I am struggling with this. It was fine right the way up until nine o'clock. God, you've got a lot of technology, haven't you? Something went wrong. Hmm. I am going to try. I'm going to try a turn off on a complete hard reset. Uh, run all of the the, the uh, updates are done. Jonesy only popped on earlier to grab a Shelby GT three fifty. Mad Mikey, no online for me today. Just a lot of grinding with new builds and tidying up some liveries. Uh, I'm totally off public lobbies. Easy old dash is really good, John. I use that. Well, I do when I can get it hooked up, but for some reason, just lately, it's not wanted to hook up. Um, it's quite easy to set up. For some reason, um, I need to reconfigure my phone. I think that my IP address has potentially changed on the PlayStation, I think, and I need to look that up and get it all reconfigured. Uh, but Easy Dash is, is really rather nice. It really is. Right, let me just make sure that I'm still on my wired network, which I am. So that's all hunky dory. Uh, obviously, I know I've got you on me rather than the PlayStation at the moment, but you can see that I am doing bits and pieces. And I uh, forgive me, I'm not saying hello to everybody in the chat at the moment, even though it's tearing through at a great rate of knots because I am frantically trying to get sorted out. We've got a lot of races to get through tonight with this advanced schedule. It's difficult to know how many races we're actually going to do in the allotted two hours. And I think we're already beginning to be going up to midnight. 
and this is not helping one iota um, so we'll go into the world map we'll go into multiplayer into the lobby and uh, while that's doing that i'm not going to say hello to anybody because i know i will miss somebody out even though i can see the new people coming in at the moment Uh, Mad Mike here. I watched your video today, Mitchell, about the weekly races. Nicely done, and it's exactly how I do them. Um, right, let's get into this. Load the settings. STC race. Uh, we are eight laps at San Qua, and the settings are, and unfortunately, everything's gone through really, really quickly. I'm probably not going to be able to see what they were. Uh, I think Jack Kobe was saying, let me just see if I can scroll back up to where Jack's message to me was. Um, where's Jack? I've lost him. He didn't load up suspension. God, it's so much chat that's gone through. Um, you need body height. Okay, body height adjustment. All of the suspension, toe angle. So we don't need the diff camber. So basically, I think what you're saying is it's as per that. So let's apply that. We'll save those settings. Um, I ought to put it on the large screen, actually, so you can see what I've done. Um, I'm going to save that away. Overwrite that. Yes. OK. And then so basically for the settings i've gone with body height adjustment anti-roll bar dampening ratio natural frequency ned of camera angle toe angle and brake balance those are the options that i've got set and i'm over the top of some of them um there we go that'll be better you can see all the settings that i've got now let me just put the chat back to where it is so i can see the latest things that are going on OK, so um, I'm not getting anybody saying otherwise. So I'm going to apply those and um, 65 litres. That's maxed out. That's all good. Um, I have got no clue, guys, why that all crashed. That is a real pain. Right, let's see what happens. Very, very strange. Very strange indeed. Uh, we don't want any more shenanigans like that. PS5, please. Okay, so before I was so rudely interrupted, um, I was mentioning that uh, Run Raisin is in the Discord chat. If anybody wants to join him, that is for the lobby. So you can have a good old whinge and whine about me in there because I won't be listening because I've got too many other things going on. And um, I'm in the saint Croix race, the STCC practice in the GR4s. I do not know this track at all and I am a complete nightmare around here. I just tried doing a couple of laps before nine o'clock just to see if I could get to grips with the track and well I crashed and crashed and crashed so I'm almost definitely going to be crashing into everybody tonight and for that I apologise um, and it also means I am going to be qualifying right at the back of the grid I hope 
so that I can learn overnight as to um, how best to run this race by watching some of the replays uh, as I did last week. I'll get better because on Friday we need to redo this race and uh, for those of you that weren't watching on Friday I am still top of the tables in the STCC the, the Super Touring Car Championship um, after four rounds. I cannot believe that I've just said that. I thought when uh, when the guys came on on Friday during the lobbies and said I was still top, I thought I was being, I thought you were all pulling my leg, if I'm perfectly honest. Uh, you weren't. Uh, I am still top and I am blown away by that. Uh, completely blown away. Uh, but there we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, Mad Mikey. Yep. These lobbies are filling up really, really, really quick. Right. I'm not going through and saying hello to everybody in the chat at the moment because it's just going through so quickly and I'm struggling to keep up with it. Um, right. If um, usual rules apply, please, if you do punch somebody off or otherwise bang doors with them or punt them off or basically ruin somebody's race, please just give the place back by way of an apology and then just explain what happened in the chat and hopefully we'll all be friends. If there is a racing incident that you want the stewards to have a look at, then please, there are some notes in the description in the video on how to do that. Please use that facility. Don't send them to me direct because I'm just going to push you to the stewards. Worked really, really well uh, over the weekend when we have one. If you do want to um, get my attention in the chat, please put at PlayStation Mesa so that it puts my name in an orange box because, well, there's already three, four, maybe five pages of, of, of text that's gone through already um, while I was just playing around getting the room set up. Crazy, crazy, crazy how busy the chat is these days. Um, and my attention is usually elsewhere as it is now because I am about to read out the people who are actually in the room. We've got 16, we've got Jack Kobe, Hey, Kushti's in. I thought you'd um, you'd given Gran Turismo a miss for a while, but um, cool beans. Good to see you back, my friend. Uh, College of Tom is in the room. Shumi, Gamer Dan, Jenki, Ernie Ball, Carlos, myself, Mad Mikey, Jonesy, Malkovich, Speedy B, Thugs, Rum Raisin. Welcome back. Not seen you for a while, but I'm glad that you have come back and racing with us. And uh, GT Tom, uh, there are a few people that we're looking forward to racing with us this evening that are not in that list. So, um, yes, there will be a few people wanting to get in. I have no doubt. Um, but we are going to get this one underway in a couple of minutes. What I'm trying to do now is to have just five or ten minutes of practice, then five minutes of qualifying and then the race. We're trying to do a race every half hour and Theoretically, I want to speed through it again. We're 20 minutes into this one before we even start because I lost 10 minutes trying to get this lobby sorted out and um, get it stable after a system crash. Just as the lobby went live, we literally did about five minutes of practice, some of us, and then everything just turned bad on us. Uh, Jack Kobe says, I need practice. Ha <laughs> ha. Jack, I can't do a lap around here without crashing. I crashed about three, four times. I'm going to be so slow, um, but what I am going to do is what I did last week or the week before, and I'm just going to watch the replays. I'm going to learn and get quicker and quicker because I need to stay top of those tables. And I know that there are people like you that are going to have something to say about that. I know. And too right, too right, too right, too right. Uh, so can I, as Rum Racing has just said in the chat there, hello all. I will be available in the Discord Lobby Voice channel for anyone that would like to join. Uh, please pop along and join him and um, that would be grand you can talk away whilst you are racing uh, it looks like he's the only one in there at the moment uh, the only reason I am not in there is because I've just got too much going on running the stream and it's one more thing to take my attention and I struggle racing and running the stream as it is without listening to um, the lobby chat the other thing with the lobby chat for people that are watching the video um, or the, the stream either before, during or after you hear one side of the story. And I never really like that. If I'm responding to somebody in my ear, somebody can't get the context. At least if I'm responding to somebody in the um, 
in the chat you know what i'm on about as i am about now Mad mikey says is anybody got a working lap time counter i just did one lap and it still says zero 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 um right let let's just get into the qualifying guys and see how we go and if this is going to just become just a pile of nonsense we might end up having to cancel out of the lobbies and um take a rain check for a day uh, fargo says it's doing two warm-up laps again was doing it earlier so is it doing that earlier in in my lobby or was it doing that in general Right, my counter is counting up. For what it's worth. Ooh. I have got no answer for that, if I'm perfectly honest. Yep, yeah, mate, I know I am. I'm still trying what i do is i want to qualify last in this and i also want to get used to this track on the hard tires if i can do it on the hards i can do it on the softs uh, so yeah i'm on the hards by uh, on purpose i know you would never normally qualify on these and when i do this for real i will qualify on the uh, soft tires uh, but for now i'm doing this on the hards as I was doing last week, I was qualifying nearly every night on the uh, on the hards because I'm still trying to get to grips with this car on these harder tyres. I tend to find that when I get on the soft tyres, I find it really easy. That's a lovely livery, Kushti, on that car. But Welsh boy, thank you for the heads up. It could well have been a mistake. Well, in actual fact, it's a mistake because you should be on the hard, on the sports soft tyres doing this um, quali. But it's just me being me. This bit of this track, I just don't get. You come around there you come around there flat but this one you need to really lose some speed i also lose the car quite a bit through there coming down to this one it's hard to know where to break through there So I hope that the uh, audio and visuals are okay on YouTube and I also hope that uh, this um, game is going to hold out for us tonight. Dusu, good evening. How are you, my friend? You see, now I'm settled into my normal way of working. I can start to say hello to people. Thank you, Welsh boy. I appreciate that. Uh, but now I'm looking at chat. I put it into the wall. Yeah, I apologise for not saying hello to people that jumped in earlier on like I would normally. Um, terrible technical issues when we opened up and uh, for that reason i was uh, turning my attention to that rather than niceties and things as i say earlier on the randomizer is currently in bits having some work done on it to support the publication of the uh races that we're going to do the night before which is something that a few of you have asked what we're going to be doing when i get the randomizer back is to choose the races for the following night at the end of the stream so in other words at the end of tonight's stream normally i would do normally what i would do is run the randomizer 
to get the races that we will be doing the following day and then I can publish those in the morning so that everybody knows what we are doing um, incidentally I did do a poll to see whether people wanted to do fully random one day favorite the next day random and favorite the next day and, and Friday doing the special or whether we did a mix of fully random and favorites it was a 50 50 mix and what I've decided to do is I've decided to do a random what one random race followed by favorite races reason being is not everybody can do every day not everybody wants to race every day if I'm honest and the other thing as well is the randomizer is the fully randomizer is very unpredictable and we could well end up with a whole evening of rubbish rubbish races equally we could end up with an evening of brilliant races um, but if we end up with a whole evening of rubbish races it's just going to be horrendous so I was thinking we just do one random it's either good and we put it in the randomizer or it's not and we scrap it but then we go into favorites that we know are good races so that was my decision on that one it was 50 50 split so I I took the decision on which way we would go um, but thank you to everybody who is in discord and that is contributing to ideas with where the channel is growing uh, I'm well into my five-year plan now and um, I've actually started to think about the five to ten year plan if YouTube keeps going that long and if Gran Turismo keeps going that long um, some very big very ambitious plans for the community this isn't so much the channel but for the community now I'm actually looking beyond the channel and what we can do together as a community uh, some very very ambitious plans uh, that I'm not going to talk about too much at the moment um, because they are a little bit outrageous if I'm perfectly honest okay right um, where am I qualifying at the back thank goodness for that. oh not quite at the back um, okay those of you that are around me please 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 accept my apologies if I hit you um, I am all over the place in this one uh, one of the things I do want to do now is <laughs> weirdly is I'm going to go to the racing soft tires for yet another reason right let's get this one underway see how we go Good luck everybody, please keep it respectful, if you do bump anybody please get the place back by way of an apology, you all know the rules I think, I don't need to harbour on those too much. Oh that was a terribly slow getaway. Right, let's just let a few of these cars through because I do want to follow rather than be followed right now because I want to try and learn this track uh, running with GT Tom at the moment on the inside of me Right, this is a nightmare because this one tightens and then here you just need to get it slowed down a little bit with a lift or a bit of brake. Going across the bridge is about the only bit that I can do. Whoa! Nearly got into the back of those guys. Well, not quite sure what's going on there. 
Lots of people slowing up. Got loads of people on the wall. What is going on? Are they all just waiting for me to go to the front? So now they can all come charging through and cause me problems. Uh, Drat Fury, yes. Um, thank you for the tips that you put up on Drat uh, on Discord earlier. I did read through them. I haven't committed them to my memory yet. Um, it is all part of what I want to do when I've got a little bit of time. Whoa. I think that was me turning in on Christy there. Whoa. Oh, we got a lobby crash. Has it crashed again? Oh, man. Christy, is it crashed for you? Christy's still running. This is interesting. Right, let's... Um... Yeah, Christy and I were running, guys. I've just closed it. I've just closed it because it, it basically crashed for just about everybody. But not everybody. That's weird. How can it be fine for some and not for others? And now it has crashed on me. I am almost at the pinning, guys. We should give this up as a dead loss. Jenky, I apologise. I don't blame you. I don't blame you, my friend. I could try the daily shumi, but I am not set up for those at all. I'll give it another go. Because uh, I, I want to race with you guys. Nine o'clock in the evening should be our time for racing. Try a random race. Okay, can do. I'm also going to check once we're in. Um, I'm just going to check and see what internet connection I've got. Jack, I can't imagine it will be the track, but I think I've got an issue with access. It keeps coming up and saying that I've got ac uh, issues accessing um, the PlayStation Network. I'm more than happy for one of you guys to host. Yeah, it's not looking good. Yeah, I am cable connected. OK, I am going to be back in a minute. I'm going to restart my router. But if one of you guys would like to set up a lobby, I really don't mind.
went back. Yeah. It's always just not upstairs. I found somewhere in the island. Yeah. It's very, very strange. Something weird is going on with the internet.
No, I'm not talking. Um, I am not talking at the moment, Jack. I'm um, just trying to sort out what is going on here. Uh, it looks like Kushti's having trouble too. Uh, we've had some pretty strong winds down here today, but I've been on the internet all day and it's been absolutely fine. Um, the girls downstairs have been streaming some stuff on Sky and it's been fine. Um, I was just checking my um, connection to PlayStation Network, but I, I think it may well just be one of these days again. Um, my internet connection was really strong. So Manchester and Chesterfield have had hailstones like snow. Wow. Jenk is saying it's a GT7 issue. It's happening a few times. Um, so we're connected fine. And the connection status, if I connect, if I test that, normally I'm up around about the eight, nine hundred download. Um, So I've got 925 down. Anything over 10 up would be good. Uh, run raising it would be interesting that you will probably have a secure, I mean, 27 up. That's huge. Much, much more than I normally get. Uh, yeah, on an American server would be good. The only problem is I would imagine that a lot of us in the UK will be quite laggy for you and uh, that might cause some issues um, that's my only concern uh, Kushti thinks his is working now mine seems to be up um, now the one thing I don't want to do is if Christy's taken the time to put a lobby up. I don't want to find he's only got no people in there. Um, but it may well be that we've got... There seem to be quite a few people online tonight. So it might be that we get people in both lobbies, Christy. Um, let me see if I can get Christy's... Are you... Hopefully Christy's streaming which he is. Let me have a look and see how many people he's got in his lobby. Um, so he's got Jack Kobe, Shumi, Gamer Dan, and himself in there. I've got a few in mind. I think, um, even though you've robbed all the good ones, Christy, I think we should be able to run um, two, two, um, two servers. Right, I've got 11 people in mine at the moment. Run, raise, run, raise and jump in with mine then, mate. If you can't find Christy. I've got 11, so I've got uh, five more spaces in mine. And I think Christy's got some space in his too. Obviously, Christy will not be listening to me now. I very much doubt it.
Right, okay, so I've just got to cush these up at the moment. We've got 16 out of 16 in mine at the minute. Jack, no, don't worry, you stay, stay with, um, Oh, you guys all headed over here now. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to... Okay, not a problem. I thought you were all going to run in yours. Um, right, I've got 16. Oh, God, this is a nightmare tonight, isn't it, guys? Um, absolute nightmare. Uh, I'm going to go qualifier in one minute. The base it at twenty one fifty one. <laughs> okay, looks like I'm spectating this one. <laughs> right, let's see how this goes. Uh, I'm not actually in this one. I'm going to be spectating. So we've got Mad Mikey in what looks like the Alpha in... I, I love that Red Bull livery. It looks absolutely superb. It really, really does. Um, let's just go display all so we get prepared for the race. Uh, Jack Kobe is um, interesting, is it? Sylvia, I didn't think you'd be in that car, Jack. I thought you'd be in your um, your race car for Friday. Uh, that's thrown me. That is completely thrown me. Uh, Shumi is in the Corvette. The white one. Carlos Fandango is in the BMW. That is his race car for Friday. It's the uh, Winkle Hot Car, I think. Yes, it is a Winkle Hot Car. Uh, College of Tom is uh, is that a McLaren? Is in? I think he's in a McLaren. Gamer Dan is in the Porsche. Speedy B is in the Veyron. That's going to be a ring taxi, or it could be a safety car. Can't remember which it is now. Unfazed. That looks like that is a Hurricane. Quite a busy uh, livery on that. Oh, it's a Super Mario livery, that one. Jenky Racing in the Ferrari in his uh, classic grey or silver, black and yellow. Just getting himself out of the gravel there. Commentator's curse, as soon as I jump to him, you put it in the gravel. Malkovich in the G70. That's the Rapid Fit car. Now that is his car that he will be running on Friday. Uh, that will be his car. Uh, 
Again, when I'm saying that these guys will be running these cars on Friday, that is that they will be running these cars in the Super Touring Car Championship that Jackie Daytona has put together on Playwright's channel. So these are the cars that they will be running. Uh, Jackie Boy is in the Honda. I think, I think that's a car that he's running. I'm not entirely sure, but that's the Subaru. Definitely one of the cars that is uh, running in this particular championship. Uh, Lusu is in a Sylvia as well. Oh, that's a really nice looking car. I do like that. The silver, black and red. Looks really nice. Uh, Kushti, I think, is in a McLaren. Really nice livery on that McLaren. Good to see Kushti back racing again. Not seen him for a week or so. But um, good to have him back racing with us. Always a popular racer. I would say that it was one of our quickest, but there are a few quick guys that have come in. So there could be some really good racing in this one tonight. And GT Tom, he's in the Sylvia as well. Uh, I've been racing with, with GT Tom uh, last week. We've had some close races and um, I think we're pushing each other now. The two of us is uh, getting quicker and quicker and quicker and quicker. And I've been enjoying racing with him. Uh, so those are your runners. You've got Mad Mikey, Shumi, Jack Kobe, Carlos Fandango, Collie de Tom, Gamer Dan, Speedy B, Thugs, Unfazed, Jenki, Malkovich, Jackie Boy, Lusu, Kushti and GT Tom. Unfortunately, I didn't get into this one. I thought I'd entered, but it looks like I started the quali uh, without entering somehow. My, my brain was all over the place trying to get all of the bits and pieces uh, sorted out for the stream following the technical shenanigans that we had and for which I apologize um, I don't quite know what the issue was uh, it looks like Kushti was having similar issues on his channel um, these things do happen from time to time unfortunately okay so that has this is actually quite good because this has given me a moment just to sort out my screen because my chat has blown up in OBS uh, for the moment. So I'm just trying to get the uh, other chat window working so that so if I go um, testing chat, okay, it does seem to work. Right, okie hokey cokey. Um, we'll have a quick look and see what the lap times are like. But everybody's chasing a 219.5, which is the fastest lap by uh, Jack Kobe. And I'll remind you, this is the feature race, so people will need both. Um, the medium and sorry the the hard on the soft tires and for the moment i can't actually go in and do this jack yeah you should be running i think you should be running the car that you need to be running on friday my friend um because this is supposed to be practice for friday um so racing hard and um racing soft tires required so that's just a reminder that everybody needs to do that um 
Oh, are you down as a reserve? I thought you'd actually got a spot. What I would do is I'd contact um, Jackie Detona and to see what the score is for Friday. Because if you are going to be given a spot, you really need to know now so you can prepare. It's not fair for you just to have to drop in right at the last minute. Um, I'd contact him and see. I really would. Because I'm pretty sure that somebody dropped out yesterday. I saw in the chat that I think somebody's actually dropped out of it. I might be lying, so don't quote me on that one. Um, College of Tom, once I've actually got the qualifying underway, I don't think I can let anybody back in uh, unless you can get in. Um... Yeah, and no, I think you and I both out. I've, I've actually, um, it, it didn't put me in as well. So I'm, I'm not racing this one either. Right, I'm going to start the race and um, we'll see how we go. Yeah, Jack, I would. Just see. Because the sooner you can get in the car or whatever car you're running, uh, just make sure that I've had a chance to contact him and, and tell him not to put you into a Super, will you? Uh, not into a Super, into the Sylvia. Um, I don't want you in Sylvia. Definitely not. <laughs> I don't care what you're in, so long as you're in. Um, okay, so Jack Kobe up front, Mad Mikey second, Gamer down third, Carlos Fandango fourth, Shumi fifth, and we are away. We are away and running. Let's go on to the fan view for the moment and just enjoy all these different liveries on these cars. Looking really, really beautiful coming down into the first corner. That's bit sweeping right hand up. Cars all seem to have got through that first corner without too much trouble. What three wide through this corner. Go almost four wide through that corner. This is going to end in tears in a minute. You just know it. Oh, it looks like one of them going wide on the exit of that uh, that corner there. But, oh, Gamer Dan seems to be jumping. No, it isn't. Who's that jumping out of the way? Matt Mikey, I think. Oh, has he just had a technical issue? We've got more technical gremlins. We've got at least one car that has jumped off the track. Uh, it's all really close at the moment, just as we're looking down through the field as we go across the bridge. Just enjoying these cars on this first lap as they sort themselves out. Lovely view down there across the bridge on board with uh, Malkovich right there at the moment as he comes over the top of that little rise. Okay, let's jump on board with the follow cam and just see what we've got going on. So at the moment, We've got Shumi up front, Gamer down in second, Jack Kobe in third, Carlos Fandango in fourth, and Malkovich fifth. Uh, Lusu is in sixth with a half second penalty at the moment. Uh, Thugs chasing down in seventh, Jackie Boy in eighth, Speedy B in ninth chasing Jackie Boy. Uh, Kushti looks like he's just making his way oh, through the traffic, just going past uh, Jackie Boy. But, oh no, Jenki gets a run up the inside of uh, Kushti. Kushti's got the inside through this one so we're going two side by side through here. Jenki giving loads of space. Just getting the better of Kushti through there. Unfazed a little bit off the back of this group. Then GT Tom. Mad Mikey's still running but uncharacteristically um, way off the pack at the moment. Uh, Speedy B in the Bay Rump, just taking a visit to the barrier there, just as I join him. Um, so up front at the moment, you've got Jack Kobe chasing Carlos with Shumi and Gamer Dan just a little bit further down the road. Um, yeah, Jonesy's just confirmed, Jack, that um, Kuro's dropped out of the STCC. I thought he had. Kuro is really not very well at the moment with um, COVID. Uh, my best wishes go to Kuro, although I doubt if he will be listening. But um, get well soon, my friend. You're you're being missed all over the place. Um, so up front, 
you've got Shumi really pushing Gamer down at the moment. This Corvette going really, really well against, I think it's the Porsche up front. As we get across to the other side of the bridge, is he going to make a move up the inside? No, he's just going to tuck in behind. He's just going to continue to hassle the car in front. Look for that little opportunity to go through. So just settling in behind now. If I know Shumi, he's just going to sit and wait for his opportunity and he'll take it as it comes. Just dropping back Malkovich with a penalty now. He's dropped way off the back of Jack Kobe. So Jack is in a little bit of air of his own at the moment and now an opportunity without any defending going on to close up on the two cars in front. So I'm imagining as Shumi and Gamer Down are battling that this is going to close up and we're going to have a three way race a little bit later on remember these guys have got to change for tires uh, those that are running on the racing hards will need to change to soft so are on the racing soft will need to change the hards that will change the dynamic of this race completely as we go through it on board Belusu at the moment chasing down thugs and malkovich this is a three-way battle kushti's just off the back of this one malkovich has uh, i think just served the penalty so as we head down the start finish straight thugs get in the opportunity there jack kobe is diving into the pits on lap two to put on the soft tires that is going to be a long old way to go on soft tires my friend i'm interested to see how that one is going to pan out what's that six laps whoa okay um going to be interesting to watch so out the front you've got Shumi and Gamer Down still going for it Shumi looking for an inside as we go down towards the bridge had to back out of that one you can see how the racing soft tyres are wearing already on that Corvette uh, quite badly worn uh, and Gamer Down's not looking an awful lot better either so um, I'm very interested in how Jack Kobe's tyres are going to last in this one looking at the state of the two up front but then again the two up front have been sparring all of the way through this one so far so um this could be that these two are just leaning on their tires a bit whereas if jack kobe has got a little bit of air he may well be able to conserve his tires shumi looking for a switch underneath oh he looks like he may well have got that done what a move what a move i wouldn't be surprised if shumi had just spent the last couple of laps looking to see how Gamer Down is taking the corners and then he made his move now it's Gamer Down's opportunity to see how Shumi runs his race where Shumi is fast and where he's a little bit slower and where Gamer Down might be able to make a move I tell you now my friends this one is far 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 from over and thankfully we cut to that just at the right time a little bit further back uh, Thugs is chasing down Lusu at the moment so fourth and third Malkovich just a little way off the back of there so round about a second between those three uh, Matt Mikey is just about a second back but with a half second penalty uh, Jenkins about three seconds off the back of uh, Matt Mikey Carlos Fandango about a second off the back of Jenki and um, looks like he may well be catching Jackie Boy about a second off that as well but he takes a visit to the barrier that's going to uh, lose him a chunk of time and it does he now falls back to two seconds behind. Uh, it looks like another car just dived into the pits there, I think. Uh, Kushti is running in tenth at the moment, unfazed. All oh, Kushti's going into the pits. Jack Kobe pulling a move on Van Faze. That is going to be the difference in the tyres. Look at that. The, you've got Jack Kobe on the racing softs and unfazed on the racing hards. And Jack Kobe basically just waltzes around the outside. The state of Jack Kobe's tyres at the moment, not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. Uh, GT Tom still on the racing halves, running in the 11th. And uh, looks like dusu has been in for a stop on the... Oh, no. Mm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I was going to say that car has dropped down the order a little bit. But that's racing hard tyres now. Christie's back out on the racing softs. So I imagine there's going to be some fireworks now as he 
gets the hammer down and really starts making tracks in that McLaren. Speedy B just taking a trip onto the grass into the barrier. Let's move on <laughs> back to the front of the grid. And we're on board now with Gamer Down and Shumi. And ooh, I'm not going to say anything. But for those of you that are watching and not racing, you will see what I'm looking at. I have no doubt. I'm not going to say anything in case these guys are listening. Uh, Gay Mad Mikey now finds himself in third place and running about 13 seconds behind the two in front. The two in front are way, way, way out in front. Gamer Dan just pulling a move on Shumi there. Wow. Uh, Kyle is just saying, oh, am I missing something here? Pretty sure everyone wants to race. Oh, there are lots of people that want to race. Uh, we are maxed out on the room at the moment. And I think, judging by tonight, oh, both Gamer Dan and Shumi in. Oh, Gamer Dan, did he cut the line there? Did Gamer Dan not follow the line on the way into the pits? That was interesting. I did see that Shumi was following the line properly. Um, as has Mad Mikey, as has Thugs. Gamer Down was right over onto the right hand side. I'm hoping that that is not going to cause some issues. Malkovich is in now. Everybody seems to be pitting at the moment. Carlos Fandango is in. Jenky's in. Everybody's in. The question I have is did Gamer Down get away with that? Yes, it looks like he did. So no issues for Gamer Down, thankfully who finds himself 1.4 seconds ahead of Shumi. So, one question, is that a shortcut into the pits at San Qua? I wonder. I really, really do wonder. Whoa, Shumi binned it. No. Oh, no, 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 no. He's struggling to get off the, um, off the barrier too. That's freed up Jack Kobe to chase down Gamer Dan. Gamer Dan now 2.5 seconds ahead. Jack Kobe can smell victory now. What on earth? Very, very unusual for Shumi to drop it in that way. Oh my word, that is something that you do not see very often. Wow. Uh, Greg, welcome to the channel. This content has really got me interested in the channel. I was watching the live the other night in the STCC and the Touring Car ones really gets me interested and we'd love to join you guys. The sprint race and the feature race idea has been watching the channel ever since. Really well content. Congratulations. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. And it looks like nice mucked up. He uh, pressed don't refuel. Oh, that's going to hurt. That's going to hurt. So back with the action. Uh, Gamer down out front by 1.3, 1.2 seconds. Mad Mikey, 9.7 behind those two. Four seconds back to Thugs. Uh, Lusu is about six seconds behind. Malkovich right on Lusu's tail and looking like there could be an overtake here. Under Slipstream, he's got a lovely run down in this extremely fast right hander. Hopefully Lusu seeing that he's there. Yes, given the lots and lots of room as we go through that corner. Probably a bit too much. Two wheels on the grass there from Lusu and Kushti could see this action going on just ahead he's going to be pushing hard to get back into the action the uh, tyres looking pretty good at the moment Jenki 4.3 back so pretty spread out further back uh, if I'm honest Shumi still recovering at the moment up in 10th uh, at the moment but this is the battle this is the only real serious battle Actually, I lie because back here you've got, you know, I think the big, big battle at the moment is between Gamer Down and Jack Kobe. Most of the other races are around about a second split. Uh, there's 0.6 of a lap between these two. They've already traded places. They're using the slipstream. They know where each other are strong and where they're not so strong. And uh, well, that was that was Shumi and Gamer Dan earlier on, but I'm pretty sure that Jack Kobe would have already weighed up where Gamer Dan is strong and not so strong. Taking a different line down the hill there, um, Jack Kobe, I thought had that line all wrong, but he found a really quick way through there, and I think he's going to get the run on Gamer Dan across the bridge and get this one done into the corner at the far end. So two very very different lines 
heading down towards the bridge for these two top racers in this race. Oh, Jack going a little bit deep there. That's given Dame again a run, but they are going to need to lose some of the speed through this corner. Who is going to come out of this corner best? Jack Kobe being hassled by Gamer Dan right now. Jack Kobe trying to break the slipstream. Weaving around a little bit. He's done his two moves. He's now settled down. Gamer Dan not being by phased by any of that. So as we go into this tight right hander, heavy break in, looking to get the turn in. Gamer Dan taking a slightly tighter line. Oh, gets out onto the gravel on the exit. Is that going to cost him a tenth or two? Yes, it does a little bit. The uh, time gone back out to 6.4 seconds now. I'm hoping these two guys aren't listening to me on the stream commentate. Oh, no! No! Jack Kobe came to a full stop on the barrier. What is that all about? That just stopped dead, that car. It went from like 100 miles an hour to nothing. That's got to be an, that's got to be a glitch. Has to be a glitch. Car cannot. It should have bounced off the barrier at the very least. Oh, have we got glitches again tonight? This is going to be a shame because this was building up to be just a brilliant race. Gamer Dan. Jack Kobe, his PS5 just disconnected. We saw, mate. You went into the barrier and it just stopped dead. People all over the place have got PS5 issues tonight. I think Polyphony Digital have got an issue. I've had issues. Christie's had issues. Jack Kobe's had issues. Several other people have got issues. Oh, man. Man. Right, Mad Mikey, 4.5 behind Game of Down. Where are the battles in this one? Malkovich and Kushti. It looks like the main battle on here is Malkovich and Kushti. Let's stick with these two guys. Um, Kushti is not running in the STCC on Friday. He doesn't tend to stream on a Friday night. That's family night, uh, which I am all for. Uh, that's why I keep my weekends free for, for, for uh, family time. And we've got Malkovich, who is in the STCC, chasing down. Uh, Greg, it was gutting. Jack was going really well. And I thought we were going to have a fantastic race to the end there. And um, I was wanting to watch Jack Cody's replay. And I've been robbed of that uh, opportunity now. Um, so, yes, it looks like I could be looking at a few others. Gamer Dan could well be my go-to man this time. So Gamer Dan, I need you to put some real hot laps in for me. Show us all how to do this one. Because um, Jack Kobe's got issues and we won't be able to watch his. But I tell you now, Kushti and Malkovich going really, really nicely at the moment. You can see the different lines through here. Uh, Kushti using all of the track. Uh, Malkovich in the Monde being a little bit more conservative on the track limits. Uh, Jack Kobe just saying that would have been a great battle as I was on sauce, but do know this track one bit and Dan was on hards and seems quick around there. Yeah, I thought that was going to be absolutely brilliant, Jack. I was really looking forward to that and I wanted to follow your lap with you on soft tyres, if I'm perfectly honest. Uh, and. Um, yeah, real shame. Real shame. Okay, so we got uh, Game of Down is up the front at the moment. Mad Mikey has closed up quite a fair bit. Mad Mikey having an awful race to start with, but he's absolutely come good in this. I would, I am going to save the replay on this. I would love to see Mad Mikey's race because something happened at the early part of the race and he fell right back. Towards the end of the race, he's absolutely come alive. I love that livery. Matt Mikey does all of his own Red Bull liveries, does them absolutely beautifully. And he is closing on Game of Dan. This is the final lap. Can he close up enough? I'm actually going to stay with these two for the rest of the race. 
Let's just go back onto the fan view and enjoy this one just for the moment. Some great racing. Oh, man, Mikey just uh, has a little bit of a barrier clash there. Just a, a kiss of the arm cove as he went through. Uh, that might have just scrubbed off a bit, but actually, no, it looks like that might even have enabled him to carry a little bit more speed because it's down to point two now. He's got slipstream as we come into this tight right hander, just tucking in behind, keeping it very respectful. Time running out. We just got these little, uh, these little twisty, they're not quite S's, but I refer to them as the S's. Always oh, looking up the inside. Can he make a move there? I'm going to go back on board. Oh, right into the back of game down there. It doesn't get much closer than that. Just as we get into the last corner. This is it. This is all do or die. Whoa, game of down right off the tarmac. Oh, we've got a drag to the line. Who is going to get this? I think it's going to be game of down on the line by the closest of margins. It doesn't get any closer than that, my friends. Wow. That's the only thing I could say is wow. 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 Oh my word. Wow. What a race. Please tell me Mad Mikey pitted. Mad Mikey is tumbling down the order. Mad Mikey didn't pit, did he? Did he go racing soft, racing soft? Did he put the mediums on? Mad Mikey, what have you done? What have you done? Looks like Matt and Christy had a great race together. Oh, what did Mad Mikey do? There is your winner. Gamer Dan. Two places raised. The result. Gamer Dan in first place with a 220.0. Thugs in second with a 220.5. Malkovich in third with a 222.2. Christy in fourth. So a nice comeback for Christy. Uh, he was at the back of the grid, I think, at one point. To get fourth was a great result. Jenki racing fifth, doing really well. Halusu in sixth. Shumi in seventh after putting it into the barrier hard whilst we were on board. Cheaty Tom with a nice eight. Jackie Boy in ninth. Unfazed tenth. Mad Mikey with a one-minute penalty. He did get the fastest lap of a 218.9. But I think he went soft-softs. I think there was an error with the strategy there. Um, dropped him down to 11th. Speedy B 12th. Carlos Fandango 13th. Uh, Jack Kobe 14th. With Carlos and Jack Kobe both DNFing on that one. But your top three. Gamer Dan, Thugs and Malkovich. Congratulations to the three of you for our first race of the evening. And thankfully, thankfully, we did actually manage to get that one down. Now, if I am correct, my friends... Somebody will shout at me if I am wrong. Uh, the sprint race is four laps. I think it's half uh, of um, half distance. So I think it's four laps. Uh, is anybody able to correct me? I'm hoping it is. Uh, Mad Mikey had a monitor blackout on the first lap. Uh, so he just wanted to enjoy himself. Not a problem. Um, I'm pretty sure that it's four laps. Yeah, four laps. Um, so I changed that to four laps. Medium tyres this time, guys, and we can just go for it. No need to pit on this one. We're all good. Let's change the settings. And I might actually try and get into this one. Uh, unfortunately, in that last one, I was enjoying watching them race too much and didn't learn a thing. I wasn't looking at breaking points, turning points, gears or anything. I was just enjoying it. Um, so, again, this could be a bit interesting in this one, but we'll see how we go. Um, I'm going to go qualifier at even. At um, 22. 
uh, 25. I'm very, very quickly. I'm going to get into this one. Um, we'll see how we go. I think there may well be quite a few people. I think there's quite a few people that, um, yes, thugs, medium tires on this one. Uh, I think there's, there may well be people out there that are looking to, um, why did that let me, why did that let me put, enter with those tires? That's why. Make a quick change there. Good evening, Orb. Um, Care of Duty's call. Good night, Galactical. I hope that you uh, enjoy the rest of your day. So we've got room for one more if anybody wants it. Um, I will be going into the quali in just a moment, but we have got one more place if anybody wants to run it. Anybody looking to join? Greg, thank you for becoming a channel member, my friend. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, Jack, the, having to load up all the settings all the time drives me crazy. The problem I have is if I do the settings and then I forget to set the car up properly on the day, I'm going to be in a right old mess. And that's exactly the sort of thing that I may well do. Um, right, we've got 15 in here for this one. Uh, I'm going to get this one underway. I don't see anybody else wanting to join us at the moment. Um, so... Greg, come and join it. Come on, Greg. Are you ready to go? Right, just waiting for Greg. As soon as you're in, mate, we're going racing. Well, we're going to go quali. Philly, I'm well. I hope you are too. I hope you are too. Right, where are we? Um, hopefully Greg is joining us. I'm just going to give it a minute to see if he joins. If he's not in by 28, I will get this one underway and he'll need to join the next one. So um, 22, 28 will be go time. So just uh, 22. OK, I'm going to go for this one. And um, Greg, I think he's going to need to join us in the next one. Uh, Map Mikey, I was going to say, how do you like the track? But you haven't raced on it yet. Well, that's not entirely true because I did actually do a lap or so during the little pre-stream and I was horrendous. Um, I crashed about three or four times. Um, so this is definitely a track that I do not know. And I'm going to have to do some serious, serious work before Friday because I'll... I'm going to blow my own trumpet here. I am top of the tables in the Jackie Daytona STCC Championship. And um, I'd like to try and stay there. If at all. Well, I, I won't stay there because of the calibre of people that are joining the, uh, the championship now. But I'd like to try and stay top six if I can. 
which means that I am really, really, really going to have to work hard this week to get on top of this track, to learn it, and just to um, get myself prepared, as it were, as I've done previously. Um, the first race was uh, Brands Hatch, which I was hopeless at before this race. We then had Barcelona, which was again one of my terrible, terrible, terrible tracks. Um, I applied myself and learnt that track as best I could and did quite well. We got uh, two fours, so I should have got a third, but I wound up with a fourth after getting a silly penalty. Uh, hang on, we're on an outlap. Let's, let's not go crazy. I'm just going to try and get some space here. Uh, um, yeah, so I got fourth in the second one after a silly mistake that got me a half second penalty. That let Jackie Daytona through. In some respects, I didn't mind too much because at the previous race at Brands Hatch, I had two enormous races, real side by side action with Jackie Daytona, and I managed to get um, a win on both of those two occasions. So it was quite nice to do the same and for Jackie to uh, become triumphant on that one. But um, I do still want to try and win. But there are some very, very quick guys in that uh, that series, if I'm honest. Right, where have we got the... Um... I used to close up behind cars for quali and see if you could slipstream, but I'm told that you don't get any slipstream benefit during the qualifier. So what I'm doing is just backing out, as is the red car behind me, I think, just to get some space. get some heat in these tyres and then we'll go for a qualifier now this is going to be interesting I'm probably going to get one qualifying lap on a track that I really don't know oh yes we're at Michelin Raceway Road Atlanta I think Mad Mikey the next one um, I don't know what we're doing for the last one I can't remember now I did look so Atlanta should be good, but then again, it's a track that everybody likes. So um, we'll see how we go. We will see how we go. And of course, we've got that big compound curve at the uh, bottom of the straight on that track, which can be a race winning or what race losing uh, curve. It's not quite a compound curve, but I refer to it as a compound curve. Um, oh, Sardegna. Oh, but it's it won't be my grinding track um, so that may well be another one that I'm going to need to look at whoa I've Jiminy Crickets boy okay you're going quite nicely around that curve and then suddenly that really tightens Sardegna B oh and Goodwood oh Goodwood will be fun we'll have cars flying all over the place at Goodwood and lots and lots and lots of accidents going into the chicane. Oh, Jackie, Jackie, you picked a blinder to finish the uh, to finish up with. I'm gonna let this car go. Uh, um, finishing up at Goodwood. Wow, what what a track to finish on. That will be wicked. Uh, Greg, the room is um, PlayStation Racer uh, Live, I think. Are you a friend? Are you um, friends with me on PlayStation Network? Because you will need to be a friend to be able to find it because my lobby is a friends only. Whoa. <laughs> He's picked every single track that kills the front tyres. Yeah, and then put six time tyre wear on. <laughs> He knows what he's doing, this young Jackie, you know. He knows what he's doing. Whoa, you can't change down gear through there. Ouch. And into the barrier. So that's two barrier hits. Um, Greg, if you need my PSN details, just hit PSN in the chat and it will come up. Uh, let me know and then I'll do a friend, uh, do a friend thingy. No worries. 
no worries no worries no worries um send it as soon as you can um right christy's finished his stream uh, obviously the whole stream this evening has gone to pot a little bit because of the technical issues um, we should be well 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 into the racing by now and um, unfortunately it's all gone a bit to pot so what I might actually do oh I don't know I don't know whether we want to carry on with the races that we were going to do or whether we just want to stick we could stick with just doing this or we could stick with combos you want to do um, give me an idea in the chat on what you'd like to do I can either stick with the schedule of events and we'll get through them as far as we can or we'll just do something different I am completely open to your suggestion did you hear GRB yes you did my friend group B cars where are we uh, group B at Margio West Reverse on racing soft and medium and medium required. Right, let's um, let's get this one underway. Good luck, guys. Please remember, please keep it respectful. If you do bump somebody and destroy their race, please just back out. Give the place back by way of an apology. Explain what happened in the chat and we will all be friends. And if you need my attention, as my Mad Mikey's just done up there, um please put at playstation racer and then my name is put up in orange jumps off there and i will i will check uh jack kobe no reverse grid on this one um i forgot to do that i forgot to do that so you'll just have to run away you guys <laughs> i will remember to do that tomorrow what I really need to do is if we're going to be doing this is to use one of the slots, the daily race slots, to set this up as feature race and sprint race, if I'm honest. So I think that's the second or third time I haven't done the reverse grid. Whoa. Whoa, a little bit of bumping into that one. So this is where it tightens up through there. Oh, I nearly, nearly dive bomb gamer down through there. Had to back out of that. But Orbalator right on my back bumper too. Oh, too deep into there as well. Whoa, how are you guys going to go through there together? Keep it out the barrier. Keep it out the barrier. Oh, no, we hit the barrier. So we've got a bit of a run on unfazed at the moment. So flat through here. Then we've got to get it slowed down for this corner, which is pretty tight. Oh, I got into the back of unfazed. Sorry, mate. Sorry, 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 sorry. That was my bad. I knew I was going to clobber somebody in this. This is a, it looks like this could be a really, really good track when you know it quite technical sweeps around quite a lot let's straighten him up <laughs> so I punted on phased off now I'll straighten him up when he dropped it <laughs> so I paid back uh, my mistake oh crikey now I'm into the barrier I tell you what it's really hard to race these when you don't know them these tracks
We've got Carlos, Shumi and Christy out front. Looks like Orb just had a visit to the barrier. I need to be further over to the uh, to the left through there. into the barrier there. Crikey, come on. <laughs> yeah, lots and lots and lots of work to be done on this, I'm afraid. That is a key thing there, is knowing how much to lift or break through that corner. I think that is going to be another race winning or losing point of the track, if I'm honest. There's a few on this. There's a few real gotcha corners. I think we got some more glitching going on guys because Jack Kobe seems to have come from nowhere and in first now. Whoa! And I am looking at the chat and not what I'm doing. So I'm going to race with my, my mate Orb. I think you can take a lot more of that curb leading onto the straight, if I'm honest. I think we can take a lot more curb through there. That one I think I need to open up more. So this is quite a quick corner, I think. Coming into break at the beginning of the curb hard try and pick up the apex on this one as we go over the top getting the power down I need to be earlier than that uh, where am I going now over to this side down the hill hard to know where to actually start to slow down for this one got to look for some breaking points I'm okay onto the bridge within reason I think now Jack Kobe out front, Shumi in second, Malkovich in third. Oh, I've got a bit deep into that corner. Well, guys, I think I'm going to be glad that we're going to be practicing this one this week leading up to Friday. I'm also hoping, and I'd like to think, that the practice that we did for Barcelona over the last couple of weeks led to a amazing Super Touring Car final on Friday. Um, some great racing. I know one or two people got roughed up. I've seen one or two reports of uh, some issues in that one, which was a shame. But on the whole, I thought that the racing was really, 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 really good. Uh, it's a great event, really well organised. And obviously if people can practice beforehand I think it's all the better there's a little bump there that unsettles the car which pitches me into that barrier I've got to work on that oh, I need to take a lot more of the curb through there and not hit the barrier Oh, that's going to be a penalty, I'd imagine. 
You can't go across the green stuff like that. Yeah, one second for that. Maybe up the ride height a little bit. What, to clear that bump? So this one, do you hug this corner here, which would stop people coming past, but you've then got to get it slowed down for this corner and you're going to be sliding across the road. I'm thinking that that is possibly the better way through there. I need to be longer and harder on the brake pedal there. Much longer and harder on the brake pedal. Whoa, um, what's that Jack? You flick the weight there off the throttle. What do you mean by that? As in you come off the brake, off the, the throttle briefly. Or do you blip the throttle? So that's midway through the corner. So I'm assuming you're coming off, off the power to drop the, uh, take the weight off the front tyres. Is that what you mean? Push the weight onto the back of the car. Then right to shift the gravity over. Oh, left then right. Okay, I'm with you. So a slight lift, left and right. Almost like a Scandinavian flick, really. Which I tried and messed up. <laughs> oh my word. You're always close on this one too. Well, 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 we did rubbish there. We got a lot of work to do. Morgan, Mitchell Morgan Racing, you have got a lot of work to do, my friend. A lot of work to do. Well, 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 well. Right, so your result, Jack Kobe in the Sylvia with the fastest lap of a 220.1 in first place for full house. Uh, Shumi in second with a 220.5. Gamer Dan with a 220.2 in third. Malkovich in fourth. Jenki fifth. Thugs in sixth. Mtech in seventh. Carlos Fandango in eighth. Lusu in ninth. Speedy B in tenth. Kushti eleventh. Unfazed twelfth. Jackie Boy thirteenth. Mitchell Morgan fourteenth. And Orbalator in 15. Your top three, Jack Kobe, Shumi, and Gamer Dan. Gamer? Gamer Dan. Well done to all of you. Uh, Jack Kobe says, uh, you thought it was a glitch, but went from fourth to first. You went from fourth to first. Wow. I'm going to do a, a save the replay on that one. Because I didn't save the replay on the first one. Uh, but that at least gave me some idea of what to watch for on that one. Um, okay. Um, unfazed, Mitch, why did you wait for me? I didn't go off track because of you. Because I wanted to race with you, my friend. My, I was all over the place. I just fancied racing with you. Uh, it's that easy. Right. Okay. Um, does anybody want to throw up a combo or do you want to go with the plan? The plan, I'll load up the plan. The plan was to go for um, Auto Dromo Mazzi or West End Reverse in the Group B cards. Oh, let's 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 just stick to the plan, shall we? That that's what we said, and people might have gone and grabbed cars and things. So we'll we'll stick with what we're supposed to be doing. Um, we are on racing soft and racing medium tires. And there is a requirement to run the medium. Um, right, let's just grab the 
That actually seems quite a good race. I think Jackie has picked some really good races. Um, Greg, I haven't got a um, I haven't got a friend request for you yet. Do people want to do that again? Can I get a thumbs up if you'd like to do that race again? Why am I not getting Greg's request? Oh, we're getting loads of thumbs ups. We've got two thumbs ups. I think Kushti wants to do it again. That's three. Mtex saying yes. Greg, what's your PSN name, my friend? Right, we're doing the eight lap and then we'll do the four lap afterwards. Have a miss second, guys. I'm just saving this so we've got it for the week. Can you max out your friends on PSN? Dowie Motorsport. Uh, I didn't even know that you could max out. So Dowie. Okay, friend request has gone. The friend request has gone. As a reminder about the tyres. <laughs> I'm going to do my usual. I'm going to go for the hard tyres for the quality. We'll do the qualifier at 22.55. Um, no, it's um, Game of Dan. It's racing hard and racing soft for the eight lap feature race and then it's racing medium for the four lap sprint race just to be sure that's the reason why i'm putting the little note out all the time just so that people know um it looks like we've got a full room at the moment greg uh i'm afraid that is one of the issues with my lobbies they get very very popular at the moment 
Um, we sometimes will have somebody else that's running a parallel lobby so that we can cater for a wider number of people. Uh, but sometimes that results in only two or three people in the other lobby. We haven't quite got a big enough mass of people that want to race. At the moment, it's around about 16 to 20 all the time. Whereas I need, really need to get to the point where we've got like, you know, 30 people that want to race and then we can fill two rooms. Um, Drat Fury is often open to setting up a lobby, as is Christy and one or two others have uh, expressed um, that they would they would do it at some point. Uh, so in this one at the moment, we've got Jack Kobe, Christy, Gamer Dan, Lusu, Jenki, Carlos, myself, Drak Fury, Malkovich, Technic, BMW, Speedy B, Orbalator, Jackie Boy, Unfazed, GT Tom and Thugs, who looks like he's just changing, um, changing something. Um, Gamer Dan, PD should really expand lobbies to 30, to be honest. Absolutely, they should. I was watching an ACC video uh, online the other day and the amount of cars they cater for is brilliant. I'd love to have bigger, bigger lobbies. Um, I really think we should have 20 again. Really should be 20. Really, really, really should. Um, right, I am going to get this underway. Uh, Greg, if you're not in the room, I apologise. Hang around because once we get to 11 o'clock, very often some people will drift away and I'm pretty sure that there will be a uh, room coming up a, a space coming up in the room and I have a very funny feeling we're going to be doing feature sprint feature sprint feature sprint the whole night long now I'm going to scratch what we were going to do and we'll just go back to doing doing this for tonight it's all been a bit of a mess with the technical issues that people have been having and uh, if this is running okay I think that's what I'd like to do this evening if any of you uh, and not up for that, I apologise. And there we go. Come on. Get me out on track. Crikey, look at that. That's nearly 20 seconds of racing and it wouldn't even let me out. What's going on tonight? So this is quick through here. Keep over to the left, then we want to pick up that curb, get that slowed down over the top of this one, back on the power. Now this is the tricky bit. I think I want to hug this corner around here, but when we get to that point there, maybe a little bit early. I really need to let the car behind me through because I'm slowing them up. Let's just let him through. Sorry, thugs. I'm getting in everybody. I knew I was going to get in everybody's way tonight. I wanted to do a little bit of practice on this before the stream started, but um, unfortunately, it wasn't to be. Right, now when we come around here, we're looking for this little black bit. But tell you what, this corner goes on and on and on and on and on. Oh, I need to hit the barrier there. You could hear my voice going up as I thought I was getting closer and closer to the barrier. Woo! Right, flat through this one. Be brave. Oh, I can cut the corner more there. Don't need to be that far over. Down through here. Don't break too late, Mitchell. That was not good. If you come out midway through the corner, you know, as in mid midway across the track, you know you've not done a good corner. Oh, that, that, that line was wrong through there. That's, that's a little flick that you've got to do. And I did a little bit with the, um, trying to balance the car, but also do a little bit with the steering wheel there. Whoa, that's got that all wrong going into that last corner um, yeah bit of a flick I think Jack was saying left right which worked it's like you're almost turning into the corner like you're going to crash but then you can do a bit of right and then get the car across and I don't know if I did that as he wanted me to but it seemed to work oh that's off the track again
Yeah, Greg, what I normally do is I go through the uh, parameters for each race before we do it. Um, with the randomizer, you'll see the randomizer will go up on screen and you can see all the parameters for every race that we do. When we're doing like these, um, these races, where a lot of us are practicing for, um, oh, sorry, whoever that is behind me, go on, you go. Sorry, Tom. Uh, yeah, when we're doing these like practice races for STCC, then I normally shout it out in the game chat just so that everybody knows what the score is. Right, I can't use my normal braking thing on the floor there, so I've got to use the barrier. So I normally use the triangle that's on the floor, but I can't if I'm tucked up behind another car. Right, right the way out to the right, sweep across when we see this, braking on that. Back on the power when you see the uh, the coloured bollards. And I'm now into a race with my old mate GT Tom again. Right, over to the left. Sweep in. Pick up the apex. Do we want to pick... Don't want to pick up the apex. So I want to be on the outside of the corner. Heavy on the brakes. Oh, I didn't open that one up at all. GT Tom did that better than me. Learn from that. Can go down there quicker too. There's a little bump. You can actually see the little bump when you're going through there. Oh, my car slowed down there for no apparent reason. Okay, using more of the curb through the wear helps. Oh, right, we're qualifying in an 11th, although we're on hard tyres, so I'm not going to worry about that too much. Game with Dan, um, when you mentioned, oh, I thought it was medium for the eight lap race, I think you're getting caught out like me because when we started, I think we had a 14, we had a 14 lap race, then we did a 12 lap, and I think this one is eight and then a four, I think. I'm right in saying that. Um, so this is the feature race, which is eight, eight laps. I think it's because it's a much longer track, this one. Um, right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to change to the soft tyres because I want to see how long I can go on those tyres in this race um, because very often these tracks are killing, absolutely eating the tyres. So it says an eight lap race. Um, we need the racing soft and the racing medium, uh, racing soft and racing hard tyres so I'll say that again racing soft and racing hard as you can see on the screen there people will need to pit um, hopefully everybody has switched to the tyres that they want as I have just done so I'm going to get this underway right now good luck everybody let's go eight seconds until we've got this race underway uh, this will be my first attempt at this on these tyres so I apologise in advance if I hit anybody no, I'm going to rephrase that. I apologise to everybody that I do hit. Um, thankfully, I'm at uh, the back of the grid for this one. Or towards the back of the grid, I should say. Right, Shumi's trip with the, um, with the start procedure here. It definitely, definitely, definitely a lot quicker than uh, using the foot brake. As you can see, it is the biggest and best trick that anybody's ever shared with me, I tell you that. It's absolutely phenomenal.
Oh, got a car on the outside of me. I didn't even see that car there. Look at the radar, Mitchell. He's still there. Give him some room. Oh, no. Did somebody leave? Rage quitting is something that we are going to start to address, guys. If people rage quit, they're going to get kicked out of the lobby for the rest of the evening because people want to race and it's not fair if you rage quit out of lobbies taking people's places so uh, the moderators are going to watch they're going to let me know when people rage quit and people will be kicked and that was supposed to be happening from today oh nearly got into the back of Drac Fury there So whoever just mentioned about the um, the quit, who quitted, please, please let me know. I've got Christy up the inside and I don't know this track well enough to be racing with top racers like this. This is the bumpy bit. Oh, so Christy broke, then he got it sideways. I put it into the wall. That is gonna let a few people through. I've got the BMW, I've got Drac coming down as well. I'm going to be in that wall too. Hard into the wall. That's gone round. Okay. I'm getting an, uh, hang, getting an idea of the, um, of the corners that I've got to work on. Uh, Reese, if you can let me who, know who quit, then... Um, We'll get Greg in. So Greg, don't run away. I believe in the description for this video, I have mentioned about people rage quitting. And I did mention at the top of this video that we got new rules in the description that we're starting to follow. Rage quitting is one of the things that several people have written to me about. And I completely agree with them because it's just not fair. Oh no, that's a bit too late. Okay, I need to break before that board. Oh, really bad backache today. Um. Um, 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 I, I'm racing, I don't quite understand that. If you put your cam on the other side of the screen, we can see who leaves. Oh, I'm with you. Would you prefer the camera on the other side of the screen? Can certainly make that happen. Right, where can I pull off safely? Don't worry, Greg, leave a bite, as you can see. Whoa! Just, just pull over, pull over, pull over. Do 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 do. Right. So, um, I 
I want that. And I think I want that. I want all three of them. Um, so the only problem we put over the other side is you're not going to see all of the runners. In, with the view that I've got now, you're not going to see all of the people that are racing. Hmm. Let me just think about this for a second. Whoa, don't want to do that. Let me just have a little think about this. Because it is something I want to address. But I'm just thinking at the moment that that might not be the best option. Um, I appreciate what you guys are saying. Um... If I go top left, I think we're losing things. I think this is what the reason why Rory has his there. Um, let me just think for a second. Because what I can do is um, within the chat. I wonder if it did. Looks like it was Orb that left the room, which is most unusual. Yeah, it was Orb that left. Now that surprises me, if I'm honest. Right, I'm going to drop into spectate mode. So if I go into the chat, we can have a look and see who 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 quit out. So that's not a problem. I can do that. All I need for you to do is to say somebody quit out. And what I probably need to do is to learn to look at the um, to look at the chat more while I'm racing, as in the in-game chat. Yeah, we're all learning. It was a good idea, though, Reese. I suspect it may well be because um, I know Orbalator, and he would not just—he's never—he would never rage quit, and he would never quit without saying something. So um, I suspect he's got some sort of technical issue, as we all seem to be getting technical issues tonight. Uh, we've had all sorts of disconnects and stuff going on. Uh, for now, um, I'm just going to sit and just enjoy the... Can I get back into this one? Once I've come out. I'm not sure I can. I'm not going to... I'm not going to spoil it. I don't want to wreck the race for these guys. Uh, we'll just enjoy this one for the moment. Oh, I tell you what. Drat Fury in second place. Look at those tyres. Oh, Gamer Dan's not looking too good either, but Gamer Dan's coming in. So Gamer Dan is in. Is Drac Fury coming in as well? Gamer Dan's a country mile out front. Thug's right behind Drac Fury now. Drac's coming in. Thug's is coming in. I bet everybody's going to come in now. Carlos Fandango. Yep, he's coming in. Jack Kobe. Oh, Jack's carrying on round. He's got some good looking tyres. So just on board with Kushti. Looks like Kushti's kind of carry on. He's got some good tyres. Unfazed is in. GT Tom is in. So MTEC is going around. Jenki is going around. Malkovich is going around. So we're probably a little bit out of kilter with the um, pit stops whilst we've been uh, playing around with administration tasks Where's the, that's the viewer so where are we up from uh, we've got Gamer Down is two and a half seconds ahead of Jack Kobe 
Uh, Kushti's about 10 seconds back from Jack Kobe. Jack Fury's five back from Kushti. Then we've got a battle royal going on here with uh, Thugs and Drac Fury. Let's just sit on with this one for the moment. Really, really close racing here. Slightly different lines with these two. One of the things I'm finding with this race is a lot of people are using different lines. Although I guess Thugs is probably using a different line trying to get some um, an undercut or an overcut through some of the corners. <laughs> Thugs flashing his lights. Thank you. I love that going across the bridge into the right the uh, left hander then we get into this tricky right hander where a lot of people wind up in the barrier you can see entering into that very very far off on the left hand side or oh, thugs looking up the inside he's going to get a run down the hill look at this side by side now absolutely side by side thugs and drag fury as they go down the hill the honda versus the sylvia who is going to come out in front Thugs has got the inside as we go through this long sweeping right hander, but he's staying left. Really courtesy, courtesy uh, really respectful, and uh, lots of courtesy through there. And I'm just enjoying this too much and can't think of the words I want. That's still side by side. Thugs just having to drop back in at the end of that. I'm going to go on board with Thugs. In fact, we do the follow cam just to watch these two drag getting it really sideways through that corner so this is the right hander before the start finish straight some of the races taking loads of the inside of that these two going actually quite wide oh i thought drag was heading towards the pits then but he's just trying to break the toe at the moment break the slipstream that thugs has got just point three behind are these two going to go side by side again in just a moment? I think that they could well be. Oh, Drac Fury is off and on the grass. That's going to let M Tech right back into this one. Drac just gathering it up. Carlos has gone through again. So I think that Drac Fury is probably going to close up on the back of these three now. And this is going to go to a four car race. In fact, I lie, it's going to be a five car because Jenkins getting in the mix track getting it just a little bit loose on the exit there Malkovich is right into this this is really close with this little gaggle of what is effectively six cars oh it's, it's, I don't know what's happened with Drac he's falling off the back badly here Malkovich with a one second penalty um, We were enjoying that race, but Drac just seems to have lost momentum for some reason a little bit through there. Uh, so Malkovic has got a one second penalty. Drac Fu um, sorry, Jenki that we're on board with now is chasing down Carlos and Mtech up front. And Mtech and Carlos are right together with Mtech chasing thugs. Poor old Mtech is got one eye in the front and one out the back at the moment while she's trying to chase down thugs and also defend from Carlos behind. Carlos has a luxury of one and a half seconds behind him, so we can just keep an eye on what's going on in front. Closing up on MTech as we go into the corner, but I think the concertina effect is going to come into play and he'll probably pull away a little bit. That doesn't actually happen. Carlos got a really beautiful run through there. As we go through this little left, right, left with the bump. There's the bump. Unsettles the car if you're not careful. Some people opting to balance the car through there. Some people opting to break through there. So it's going to be very interesting to watch the different replays and study the different cars on this one. Carlos got a lovely run as we come up towards the start finish straight. Can he get this move done on MTech? He's going to have the inside for this corner. So MTech is going to have to give him some room. He backs out. Carlos goes deep really deep oh mtech almost gets into the back of him i don't know whether it was a touch there but carlos went hugely deep then hard on the brakes mtech had a much better line there but carlos what direction and went straight across the front of his car same again there really carlos just cutting off uh mtech through there i think he was far enough ahead so i think that that was all fair 
don't think that MTech was really quite far enough alongside but a, oh MTech just getting it on the dirt a little bit through there really hard racing between these two at the moment so at the moment you've got Jack Kobe way oh I was going to say way out in front but he's not Gamer Dan is right with him we are missing a battle and a half here let's go on board with these two Jack Kobe and Gamer Dan two of the quickest guys around this track this evening Kushti is chasing these guys down as well and catching Gamer Dan with a run on Jack Kobe Jack goes for the inside here Gamer Dan decides to go around the outside Jack Kobe's going to have the inside line as we go into this tight left hander but Gamer Dan is going to have a nice switch back can he make that work he's got lovely drive off the corner again Jack Kobe on the inside Gamer Dan giving a nice lot of room Jack Kobe getting a little bit um, a little bit slower through there through that look that is the nasty little bit of track that bump there you know that's going to catch a few people out at the STCC if they're not practicing this one Jack Kobe with a nice exit stay out of the wall my friend he does he's got a lovely exit he's got a slipstream on Gamer Dan but Gamer Dan got an equally good exit out of there the gap point two it's 6.8 to Christie behind Jack goes for the move on the inside thinks better of it just backs out Gamer Dan giving Jack loads of room this is really respectful racing guys this is absolutely beautiful Jack Kobe with the inside line through here but Gamer Dan's going to have the inside line through the next one oh Jack gets out on the grass there going really really wide I think he was looking to open up that corner as much as possible he's got the inside line he's got that first place as we do to run down to the bridge we've got a slightly different line on the cars here Gamer Dan hard over to the left looking to straighten these corners can he get on the back of Jack Kobe? Can he get in the inside here? Or can he get a run under slipstream across the bridge? Is Jack going to go wide? Oh, my word. How did Jack not hit the barrier there? That was superb. But Gamer Dan has got the lead. But Jack Kobe up the inside. These two are going to be side by side. Has Jack got his nose far enough ahead? No, he tucks in behind. This is what you call real, real respectful racing borderline professional racing look at this jack kobe goes really wide he's going to look to try and get a good run off the corner more speed gamer down took the more inside line jack kobe with the slipstream now he's closing up 3.0 2.7 2.3 2.2 2.0 1.8 is he going to get a run through this corner interesting lines from both of these two anybody watching this is going to be learning 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 all of the time so gamer dan now has got the run on jack kobe this is swap and swap and swap this is stunning racing absolutely amazing all we need is a third car in the mix here and this would be absolutely unbelievable jack's tires are gone they're on different tyres, look. I'm giving the game away now. We've got two cars on different tyres. Coming towards the end of the race. Jack Kobe, oh, just getting into the barrier there. It looks like Gamer Dan is going to get that done. What a gargantuan battle. And a lovely celebration from Gamer Dan as he crosses the line. But wow, guys. It does not get any closer than that that racing was absolutely superb what a race swapping places all the time corner to corner you could see how the two of them were trying different lines to try and get the benefit and the opportunity coming out of the corners or even going into the corners absolutely phenomenal Gamer Dan at Jack, that was phenomenal. Jack Kobe, what a race, Dan. Greg, congratulations, Gamer Dan. That was great, respectful. Do you know what? That is what this channel's all about. Racing like that. Absolutely outstanding. And we were here. Do you know, sometimes when my races go to pot, as this one did, 
and it gives me the opportunity to watch and commentate. I almost enjoy that as much as I do racing. When you get a battle like that on track, it is just brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. Wow, as Ernie Ball says there, one word, respect. Matt Malkin, that little bump in the road, question mark. Yeah, it's catching a lot of people out. Um, I am going to save the replay on that one because there's so much to learn. So much to learn from those guys. Uh, your winner, Gamer Dan, with a 219.5. Jack Kobe in second place, just 0.4 of a second behind. A 219.1 and a fastest lap. Kushti chasing down. He got the gap down to two, uh, four seconds with a 219.3. Uh, fantastic racing from all three of you. Thugs in fourth. Jenki racing in fifth. Carlos Fandango in sixth. Mtek in seventh. Malkovich eighth. Unfazed in ninth. Drak Fury in tenth. Speedy B eleventh. Lusu in twelfth. Jackie Boy in thirteenth. GT Tom fourteenth. Unfortunately, I DNF'd in that one coming out of it to sort out a little bit of admin. Uh, which probably wasn't actually needed in the full scheme of things. Although we seem to have completely lost Orb, which is worrying me a little bit. We've lost him from the, the chat as well. Uh, but your top three in that one, Game of Dan, Jack Kobe and Kushti. Congratulations to the three of you. Well, you know what's coming up now, don't you guys? You know what's coming up now? Um, we got the sprint race. Just double checking. That we are on uh, the right number of laps. Where if I go into the right place? Where am I going? Four laps. Uh, slow is first. So we've got reverse grid. Now, with Jackie Daytona, what will happen is he'll make a note of all of the different places and he will switch the grid. So it'll be reverse grid based off of the um, first race. Uh, I'm not actually doing that. I'm just doing a reverse grid based on the qualifier. Uh, just for ease more than anything else. Uh, Jack Kobe, last one for me. Could you wait two minutes? Um, I think he needs the loo. Uh, yes, we can, but a little bit too much. A <laughs> little bit too much um, information there. Right, guys, remember you need the uh, medium tyres for this one. Medium tyres for the sprint race. Let me do my usual um, notes in the chat. So uh, we want racing, medium tires oh dear only in fact i think it's only going to let you um let you do that in this one uh so the car settings are going to change into medium so it should only be medium tires whoa the uh, okay that is an issue i've messed up the room guys i've messed up the room so this should be I thought I changed the tires I'm sure I changed the tires I didn't change the tires I did not change the tires um, this is the sprint race over right yes um, okay okay come out of there change the event settings hopefully we'll be good uh, yeah John I got the um, I got the wrong tyres. Uh, one of the reasons why I'm trying to set up two um, two race definitions in the uh, in the game now, because otherwise it gets too confusing, and I have a very little brain. I think you should call me Pooh Bear. I've got fluff for brains. Definitely fluff for brains. Uh, Greg, don't worry about testing out the car, mate. Uh, I'm just as bad. I'm all, as you saw, I'm all over the place. In fact, I don't even think I've finished a race tonight. Um, I'm, I am all over the place. Uh, Jack, just give me a shout when you're done. I'm going to aim. I'm going to aim to start the qualifier of this one at um, 23... 30 so long as Jack is back and we still got um, room for one more 
Uh, I am. Has anybody heard from Orbalator? I'm really worried that he just disappeared the way that he did. John, that's naughty. <laughs> so Fargo Nice says, Hey Reese, Mitch going for Ice's worst streamer ever crown. What's that all about? What's Ice's worst streamer ever crown? <laughs> this is a family friendly channel, gentlemen. Please, please, come on. <laughs> it is after the watershed, I guess. <laughs> Ice Taylor's worst streamer ever crown. Ice Taylor has hiccups on stream. You're on par, <laughs> Mitch. I said, I am the worst streamer ever. I'm sure some people just tune in to uh, my streams to see what mess up I'm going to do. Whether I forget to, I often ch forget to change the camera. I set the rooms up wrong. Um, my problem is I enjoy what I do too much and I don't think and slow down enough. Um, I, my brain is just racing and I'm just enjoying it. And in fact, at the end of a hard day, this is part of what I do to relax. It's... Um, it's, it's, it's just, I just love it. <laughs> right. Um, okay. Have we got... Christy's ready. Jack, are you back or are you still playing? Fargo, you ain't seen... I'm going to have to check out this Ice guy. Uh, what was his name? Ice Ice Taylor. I'm going to have to check him out. Let me just, let me just make a note. Ice Taylor. I assume he's a streamer. Where's me? Where's my last page? So, Ice Taylor. Yeah, my problem is I just relax too much. I just I get to the point where I'm not, I'm I'm doing a million things and just don't think things through uh, properly. Jack's back. Right here we go, guys. Let's get this one underway. Hopefully everybody's ready. I'm just gonna. A quick look through to make sure that we're all done and dusted. I've got 15 in the room at the moment. Uh, let's get this one underway. Do you know what? Do you think I might actually finish this one? What do you reckon? If I ignore the chat, I won't know if anything's kicking off. And I'll just go for it. Oh, Koda's just woken up. You all right, mate? What's up? I might get jumped on a dog in a minute. Oh, at least I'm getting away this time. Oh, coach's gone his bed. I don't think anybody can mess up a stream as much as I do. There was occasions when Rory would have the wrong camera up and people would be, Rory, camera, 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 and I'd be like, cool. Can't you even get your camera sorted out? Now I'm streaming, I realise what it's like. When you've got about 12 million things to concentrate on. The other thing I used to do was crash all the time when I was streaming. I couldn't stream and drive. Right, there's absolutely no point in me racing Malkovich because this is an outlap and then we're in a qualifier. So I'm actually going to let um, Gamer Dan go through as well. Why are we all racing each other, guys? It's a qualifier. <laughs> there goes Jack Kobe. He's showboating. I think I've got Thugs behind me. I don't know if Thugs wants to go through. 
He's actually packing off as well. Let's get some heat in his tyres. I've got to get my telemetry app sorted out on my phone as well at some point. I thought it was thugs. Ice was really shy when he first started. Well, I'm actually a really, really shy person. Um, one of the reasons why I invented Mitchell Morgan was when I go online with you guys, I'm not me. Um, some of you will meet me in time, in real, and you're gonna realize I'm a completely, completely different person um, to when I'm on air. Right, let's get on with this. Oh, track limit. No way. Oh, that means I'm not going to qualify. I must have cut that one a bit too much. Right, I'm going to try and stay out to the right here. Everybody's going the other way. And then at that point, just get it slowed down. Whoa, no, that that's... Uh, let me get out of the way. Kushti, he went through there really quick. So that line is certainly not right through there. That line does not work one iota. Uh, I'm not sure when I served the penalty either. And I need to get out of the way of Carlos, who's behind me. Uh, I'll continue to push for the moment so I don't um, don't wreck his uh, qualifier. But if I can get out of the way, like now, I'll let him go. I think that was a good pass. Hopefully it was. Right. Is there any way that I can get... No, I can't get through. Ah, I've got 40 seconds to get across the, the line and then see if there's any chance that we... No, we won't. The lap's too long. I, I'm not going to qualify. I am not going to qualify for this race. Right, is this where the bump is down here, guys? I think it is, isn't it? There is the bump. Oh, seriously got to do some work on this. This is woeful. Crikey. Joanna could race better than this. With one eye time behind her back. I'm blindfolded. Goodness me, this that's... Oh, man. I am worried for Friday now. I am worried for Friday right now. Jack Kobe right up there. And I am some massive seven and a half seconds off the pace. Yeah, Jenky, I was actually just looking at you. You had a shocker. Uh, your own words there, but 6.6, .6, but I'm still a second off of you. So if you had a shocker, you imagine what mine was like. I wouldn't be surprised if Jackie Detona is going to go for a 10 minute quali. Um, for this one. 
the only problem is it's going to have a knock on with me for my stream on Friday. That's the only thing that's a bit of a pain. Um, because obviously I can't start my stream until we're done. Right, so we're straight into the... Uh, there's no tyres to change this, so I'm going to go straight into the race. Um, yeah, I can't start my Friday night special stream until this STCC is finished. Um, so I'm hoping that we do crack on with this one this week. Has it been a 10 minute in both already? Okay, that's good then, Mad Mikey. That's good. Um, here we go. Right, so Shumi's trick for the false start. Just so that we can get away quick. Five lights and we are go. Well, Nigel Mansell got a really quick start on the outside there. I've gone too deep. Straight into the first corner. That's that Jenky up the inside. I just wanted to have a look at his livery. That's what that was about. All oh, Drax up the inside too. As you can see, I just haven't got a clue where it comes to this track. So a lot of them are going out to the left and then sweeping back across at that point. So I need to work on that a lot. Oh! That was me. Oh dear, who did I get into the back of then? Um, I'm at the back, so whoever it was managed to go through. But I clobbered somebody hard there. I apologise, whoever that was that I hit. I haven't got a clue who it was. I think it was a blue car, but I couldn't tell you who. No idea. Big apologies to whoever that was. Right now, time to try and get on it. At least I've got people I can follow now. chase down these guys see what we can do if anything at all Jack Kobe in third already my word Markovic and Speedy B getting into each other a little bit there I think Where's this track going? Oh, this is the bumpy bit, isn't it? Oh! -ho! Hard into that barrier. Where's Mal? I'm not sure if I caused that. I think he might have just followed me straight into the barrier there. Oh, I am a complete liability around here. I am going to have to practice this a lot before tomorrow evening. I am causing too much aggravation and calamity and heartache. Now to see what the circuit experience car is that's a gr4 car i should do that to death no my luck it will be something like a gr1 or 2 which won't do me any good at all jackie dotona you sure know how to pick your tracks <laughs> It's actually a really good track. I'm going to really enjoy this one when I've learnt it. Do 
just going to take a little bit of learning, that's all. A little bit of time and effort. So we've got a three-way battle with uh, Dowie Motorsport and Malkovic here. Unfortunately, I've gone a bit too wide through that one. Oh, Malk! Whoa! <laughs> I tried to avoid Malkovich and just put myself straight into the barrier. <laughs> oh, Malkovich, don't wait. Keep going, mate. Go and have a battle with Dowie. Go on. Oh, MZ, how are we all doing? Um, I'm doing great myself. Racing rubbish. I hope you're doing okay. How is everything in your life right now? Circuit experience is a GR1 Bugatti. No. What did I do? I said to do GR1 or something silly. That's not going to help me one tiny little bit. What I might have to do is just find some time after the stream. And uh, obviously I need to get to the point where I can't talk because the girls are trying to sleep and stuff. But... Um, I might just open up a public room or something and just grind this away with people um, until I get tired. You guys will be more than welcome to join. And if I can find some time during the day tomorrow, uh, I won't be out to Lawrence working tomorrow. I was thinking about doing a custom race, but my problem is when you're doing a custom race against the AI, which I'm assuming what you're talking about, um, the AI is so, so, so different to racing real people. And um, I found that when I was doing the circuit experience races and spending so much time racing against the AI, it killed my online racing against real people. And I've almost had to learn to race again. Um, and even now, when I go back to doing racing against the AI, racing Sophie or whatever, um, I have to approach those races with a completely different mindset. Oh, nose is itchy. And I don't think there's any substitute for racing against real people, if I'm honest. No, oh, that upsets the car too much through there. Hi Harold, how are you doing my friend? I hope you're well. Why are those guys pitting? Surely they don't need to pit for tyres. Or fuel. What's going on? Why are they... I need to know, why are they pitting? So, MT Motorsport is set for sophomore review presentation next Monday. It's going to be a busy week of preparation and practice. Did I pronounce that correctly? Sophomore. What is sophomore? Dear, that's showing my naivety. Everybody's going to go, what do you mean? How come you don't know what that is? You guys are out of fuel. Wonders, good evening or good night. <laughs> Thank you for popping in. Oh, no. Got that. Ah, oh, this track. It's just eating me alive, this track is. I really need to apply myself. Okay. It's really annoying because some of the corners I'm okay on and others I'm ah, woeful. That is going to be interesting because if you guys are running out of fuel, I'm not. 
how can that be that that you guys are having to pit and I don't need to that can't be right because that's going to kill your races surely if some are having to pit and some aren't how does that work Jack Kobe's had to fuel save Jack what car are you in Maybe it's just because I'm not racing very quickly. Jack's in the Sylvia. Well, look, I'm in the Sylvia and I've got 0.6 of a fuel uh, of a lap left. I've got half a lap left of fuel. That's confused me. How come you guys are running out and I'm not? Loads of fuel left. I'm certainly not burning as much. Wonder what I don't understand why. Was it good up front, Drac? Oh, that's weird. Can only do three laps full tilt. Okay, interesting. I do not seem to have any difficulties on the um, on the fuel on that one. Uh, okay, so Jack Covey was your winner with a two twenty point one. Uh, Jenky Racing second with a two twenty one point nine. Jack Fury with a two twenty one point eight in third. Carlos Fandango 4th, Thugs 5th, Gamer Down 6th, Kushti 7th, Unfazed 8th, Lusu in 9th, GT Tom in 10th, Malkovic 11th, Dowie Motorsport uh, just joined us in 12th, I got 13th, uh, Mtech was 14th and Speedy B with a DNF. So your top three, Jack Kobe, Jenki and Drac Fury, congratulations to the three of you. Right, so... In keeping with the way that this evening is going, which is not what I was expecting, we are going back to the STC feature race. Uh, Mad Mikey, yeah, it wasn't supposed to be. It's all gone a bit pear-shaped tonight. Uh, I haven't done nearly as much racing as I would have wanted. Uh, Jenky's sitting enough of this track tonight. He's out. Um, yeah, it's, it's not really got that. The stream has not gone to plan. It started really late with technical issues. Uh, I've had to back out of a few races, and it's all been a bit, uh, a bit of a, a bit of a much. A bit of a funny race, if uh, a funny stream, even. Um, so we didn't do the races that we were going to do. We've just done all the uh, run this track all night long. Um, do you want to do the Nords with the Beamer? I tell you what, it's five to twelve. No, I tell you what we're going to do. I am going to change, guys. Um, we are going to do for those of you that are disappearing because I didn't realise the time. We're heading across to, no to the Nordschleifer. We're going to be doing two laps. And the car that you need is going to be the one that I pick in a moment. And we're going to do this on... Oh, what tyres? Um, Matt, what tyres do we want to do? Are we doing sports or racing? This is in the BMW um, racing. Okay, cool. Thought we would. Uh, 
Let's change the event settings. The car that we want for this one is the BMW. Um, well, you're going to see in a minute. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, what is the car called? What is the car called? I cannot remember. Um, settings, change car. We'll come down to uh, BMW. Uh, it is a cracking, cracking little car. Um, if I can find it. It's none of those. It's none of those. It's none of those. It's that baby there. This is what we want. You want one of those? Carlos Fandango knew where we were going. Matt knew where we were going. Oh, Drac, I really wish it was the VGT. I am doing the BMW VGT uh, as an evening. We're definitely going to do it as an evening run. Whole evening with the BMW VGT and I can't wait. I adore that car. I really do. Uh, but this is a great car around here. Really good. Drag Fury, yeah, go on, you can use your Beetle. I know you love your Beetle. Yep, yeah, I seen Speedy is getting the car, not a problem. It's effectively a GER3 car, I think, this one. Um... Lusu, good night. Thank you ever so much for racing with us this evening. Uh, Jenki Racing tyres, don't care what you what you want to run with. Uh, Kushti, if you don't have the car, just go with a, uh, a GR3. Maybe go with the Beetle if you've got it. Beetle GR3, keep Drat Fury happy. Uh, I think you can, Kushti. I think it's in the BMW dealer, this one. Pretty sure it's readily available. I just need to push the door too because it is a bit late. Don't want to disturb uh, the girls that are sleeping at the moment. Let's just shut the door. I was supposed to be finishing at 11 o'clock, but uh, best laid plans and all that. I need to change that and I also need to change that so I'm just changing a few things guys in the room uh, I want to get you on track and then I'm just changing a few bits and bobs hopefully everybody's in and that will then have worked um, uh, Drax just telling me that the uh, fuel on the tyre is 6 I've changed that uh, Lusu, yeah, I've ditched the quali. We're going straight into the race now. Uh, Greg, um, what car have you got? Uh, 458, yeah, it's fine. Not a problem. John's going with the Beetle. I fully appreciate that some of you um, are haven't got the cars at the moment. Um, and that's absolutely fine. Obviously, what we like to do is have as many people in the chosen car as possible. And there is a list of all of the cars in the randomizer. Um, so those of you that do want to get the cars that are grinding for them, um, there should be a list somewhere and I will put another list up shortly. Uh, when I get the new randomizer sorted out, I will put another list up. Um, it's not a qualifier, it's a race. Um, so race, start 
at. And again, I really should be um, getting out there and doing some laps, if I'm honest. Uh, Greg, it's racing tyres, whatever racing tyres you want to put on. I'm putting racing softs on. They're not going to run out. Racing soft really all day long. So who have we got in this one? We've got Kush D, Gamer Dan, Welsh Boy, Jenki, Carlos Fandango, myself, Drak Fury, Malkovich, Dowie Motorsport, Technic, Speedy, Thugs, Unfazed, GT, Tom. Uh, I think Dowie's new around here. First time racing with us. I hope you're enjoying it. And uh, everybody else, I hope that you are enjoying yourselves. Um, Thugs will be back in just a moment. Thugs, let me know when you are back and ready to rumble, mate. Okay, right, I think you're ready to go, thugs, yeah? Just give me a thumbs up if you're ready to rumble, and then I'll start it. If I'm not mistaken, um... Thugs is checking on his mum because she had an accident, a, uh week or so ago and I uh, hope she's recovering okay um, I think I think we're all ready to go aren't we Let, let's um, let's get this one going yes yeah, it's okay she's fine so let's go let's start the race so I might have a brain like a sieve but I do remember some things I'm still a bit worried that Orbalator just disappeared. Um, that's very uncharacteristic. I hope he's okay. I'm hoping it's just an internet issue or something. If any of you are in contact with Orb, um, let me know he's right, will you? Oh, it wasn't supposed to be this sort of start. It's supposed to be a rolling start. Never mind. Right, I'm going to concentrate because for the first time in ages I actually finished this race the other day and I'd like to try and do the same again. Admittedly it wasn't in a car like this, it was in a much slower car. Whoa! Stop looking at the chat Mitchell, just got into the back of Welsh boys, sorry. Hi Big Joe, I think that was you who just popped in there. I've got my eyes on the road at the moment. Just tucked up behind Welsh Boy at the moment. Oh, itchy nose. six gears max on this one. Oh, somebody's off the road. Sam Tech. He's in the gravel too. Oh, a double whammy for M Tech there. I've got Malkovich chasing me down. Big Joe, I will get to you in a moment. I'm just um, a little bit busy at the moment. Oh, 
Right, this bit's horrible around here, so get this slowed down. The amount of times I tend to throw it off the track there is crazy. Oh, you're welcome. Uh, for some reason, your stream was not flagging up on my notifications. And I'm currently going through about a thousand people that I've subscribed to over the uh, last year or so unsubscribing to a lot that aren't doing anything and making sure that I am subscribed with notifications to you guys so that I can support you guys a bit better than I have been so lots and lots and lots of change going on with my uh, YouTube activities at the moment and the stream and stuff like that um, also I'm not going to talk about it but I did have a five year plan for the channel um, I now have a 10 year plan for the community which is going beyond the channel if things continue the way that they are uh, we've got some really really ambitious things to consider but it's too early to talk about that sort of thing right now oh no 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 uh. right start concentrating not talking oh that was a wicked 360 that might have been the best 360 of the night although that might be the only 360 of the night I've got thugs is uh, chasing me down now Where the heck is this track going? Oh! Oh yeah, you yeah. Oh, big Joe. Plans that I have got are way beyond anybody helping me. They are stratospheric plans and I'm probably going to be about three or four years before I get to that point. Just depends if the channel keeps growing the way that it is. No, 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 we're in the barrier. It's, um, <laughs> I'm not going to go there because I don't want to even start to indicate what I'm thinking. Um, but it's got nothing to do with video or music production or anything like that. No! Oh my gosh, I can't keep this car on a straight line tonight. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh Dowie sorry I'm trying to get control of this car oh, oh, tell you what GR3 cars are the bane of my life I am so bad at GR3 cars yeah no, I appreciate the offer I really appreciate the offer but it's uh, it will involve YouTube but the ambitious part of it is nothing to do with YouTube or or video production or anything like that. This is terrible. This is absolutely terrible. GT Tom's just gone past me now as well. Thank you, my friend. I really appreciate that. Uh, 
that's a really really kind offer I can't read the chat now. I'm not going only fans. What do you mean by going only fans? I've got you all guessing now, haven't I? So. Oh. So Big Joe is trying to find a good building to start a sim racing facility. Blech. Oh, that'd be smart. So people can just, that don't have a rig, come along and try it. That'd be wicked if you get a hydraulic rig in there. But no, it's nothing to do with that. Um, I'm not going only fans. Uh, this channel will never, well, won't change from where it is now. Uh, my next plan for the channel is to um, start dailies. Oh, OnlyFans is a site. Did I have to look at that? Don't even know what that is. <laughs> no worries. Yeah, I've heard a few of these little sim racing bars opening up. The sim racing really, really has taken off just recently, massively. But now what I've got planned is completely different to sim racing or anything like that. And I'm not going to say anything because it might not even come off. Okay, I'm with you. <laughs> no, not my sort of thing. There you go. Good job I didn't know what you were talking about, isn't it? A bit worrying that you know what you're talking about, but there we go. Oi, 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 oi. Maybe that's what Big Joe was talking about, about doing audio. Yes. I think we'll move we'll move quickly on on this one. No. No, no. The the idea that I've got if it comes off is very expensive 
it needs to be set uh, finance self financing through the uh, through the, the online activities that I'm doing as in sim racing activities and um, if it happens it will probably be I don't know it's gonna be a good few years because the channel's got to be generating quite a lot of cash to do it but it'd be good fun I'm lost where I am on the track now spending too much time talking not enough time concentrating Whoa. Oh, big good luck. Good luck with the sponsors. Um, I've got involved with sponsors once or twice on um, YouTube channels, and they can be a right pain. Although I know a lot of people do get sponsored. But if you're just getting sponsors on the actual equipment in the uh, in the room then that's obviously a totally different matter you can get some local businesses sponsoring you that would be awesome race for toffee tonight good night Christy catch you again very soon good to see you back racing again my friend Game of Dan, Christian Walsh, boy up front, your top three, well done, well done, well done. Well, I am going to finish this one. Just because. It's loads of graffiti all over the track. It's real graffiti all over the track in real life. It's covered in it. Um, there's one corner that's called YouTube Corner as well, where there's loads of graffiti down, but where all the the uh, people stand to get all the crashes and stuff. Um, Mtech, yeah, I, I need to do a. Um, I need to, to use one of the other um, slots I've got to set up the Nurburgring race. Um, I need to get a little bit more organised on that. Um, what am I doing? Don't do that. I want to go into the results. So your winner there was Gamer Down with a 6.37.1. Christy in second. Welsh Boy in third. Drac Fury fourth. Drinky Racing in fifth. Thug sixth. Speedy B seventh. Malkovic in eighth. Unfazed in ninth. GT Tom in tenth. Carlos Fandango eleventh. Dowie Motorsport in twelfth. I got 13th and M Tech was a DNF on that particular one. Your top three, Gamer Dan, Christy and Welsh Boy. Right. Um, I am going to bring the stream to an end at that point. Um, I might just do another half an hour just running around San Qua just because I, I want to try and get a little bit more 
used to that track so if any of you do want to stick around feel free um but i am going to call it a night at that point and i'm going to thank everybody that has raced with me this evening been very respectful had some great races i apologize that um we had all of the aggravation at the beginning of the stream with the technical difficulties it took us a long time to actually get into a lobby and get it running i appreciate kushti and the others that were trying to set up uh, lobbies as well and i think had the same sort of problem thankfully it all came good and uh, we had some good runs at San Croix afterwards and just finished up with the Nords um, so anyway I'm going to call it a night there um, I'll be back at nine o'clock tomorrow um, tomorrow morning I'll post up the races we're going to do or maybe what I might just do, use are the races that we were supposed to have done tonight I'll do tomorrow that might actually be what I'll do because the randomizer is still in bits um, so join me at nine o'clock UK evening time tomorrow. In the meantime, have a very good night. Good morning. Good day. Good evening. Whatever you're doing, just have a good one. And I will see you then. If you haven't already and you're leaving, please smack the like button for me. That would be absolutely fantastic. And I'll be back after just a 30 to 60 second break. Catch you in a minute. Okay.
it's just going to see how many people, uh, how many friends want to continue. And uh, if we get a few, I'll stick with friends because we know we're going to roast nicely. Um, alternatively, um, we will go a different route. And we've got a few coming in, so I might actually flick across to that camera. Uh, although I won't be talking quite so much. Uh, because I do want to try and learn this track a bit more. Uh, one of the things I want to do is to study the replays that we've just had with um, with some of the racers. Uh, I've got some quick people in, which will help us to learn a little bit. Um, so all being well... Um, what I'm actually going to do, I've changed my mind actually on this, uh, edit the settings, we'll go with um, practice some race and um, I'm just going to do a race after race after race after race. Uh, it's just a four lap race, a short one. We'll start this one at 30, half past, and run up to around about midnight, and then we'll call it a day. Uh, this one is more about people just trying to get to grips with the track, learn the track. For those of us that are running this um, in Jackie Dotona's lobby at, on Friday. And I've seriously got to get to grips with this. very difficult for me to do it while I'm actually trying to stream to concentrate a lot I need to get to the point where it's more muscle memory oh well have I, on. Have I got the car suspension wrong have I car suspension off oh, for it to be fair The thing is, is I've got the settings set how, um, yeah, they're set as per Jackie Doton has got them. So they are, they are set that way for a reason. three minutes and we'll get this one underway right a lot of the boys were coming over here and at that point coming across actually a lot earlier than that. Oh, we got a steward's request at Discord, have we? I'll have a look at that tomorrow. I'm not looking at that now. Hopefully we've got enough information in it, either a replay or plenty of angles for the um, issue both from the from all the cars involved
Oh, oh, oh. That corner, there's, there's three corners on there that I'm really struggling with. So is that John, have you submitted that one or somebody else? Who, who's involved in it? Back through there, hard on the brakes there, over the top, on the power. Yeah, speedy's John, pushed it so, no worries, I'll have a look at that tomorrow. Okay, so what we've got seven of us that's all right let's um let's get this one underway see how we go let's see how we go <sighs> oh dear god this is going to take some doing i've got to get to grips with this trap because I don't want to slip down the table massively to still be at the top of the table at the end of round number four is beyond my wildest expectations. Okay, no worries. Taking a look down the left hand side wasn't a good idea. Right, first blue one, tuck in. Very easy to smack that barrier on the way out there. Oh, I nearly caught the barrier. Just trying to stay with these three in front at a minute. break too slow through there that's that car lost back through 
hoping I'd go a bit defensive through here. Oh, what happened to Carlos? Hope I didn't do anything out of the uh, untoward there. Don't think I did. I think that was all good. Actan, welcome to the channel, my friend. Don't know if you're watching the live stream or just watching one of my other videos. Okay, that's a bit better, that corner. Not sure I'm taking it the same way as the other guys, but... staying second all the way down there Got it right the first time. Wrong that time. Uh. Now I got to work hard to catch up with Jenky and Welsh boy. Three seconds down the road. Jenky is uh, not slow. Neither's Welsh boy, so I've got my work cut out now. Oh. 3.8, they're going away from me. Carlos came in hot then. Ooh, the two boys in front are going away from me quite quickly. They're certainly not closing. I need an audible subscription of that. Oh yeah. Thing is, most of the subscribers come from my other channel, my other, um, a lot of my other videos. Some come from the live stream, but about 50-50 about of where they come from. So a lot of the people that are actually joining, unlike a lot of the other live streamers, they're actually coming from different places and not actually in the chat or watching on a video. Too deep, too deep, too deep. So I did uh, analyse it about a week or two ago to see where 
the subscribers were coming from and um, well, I did it actually just before the charity stream because a lot of people when I did the charity stream said oh you're only doing it to get subscribers you're doing it for yourself and over those 28 hours I was streaming I think I only got about 19 subscribers which was only um, about three or four more than I would normally have got in a regular day which indicated to me that I'm not getting lots of subscribers from streaming um, and I tend to get most of my subscribers when I've got a video that's going well Hey John, good man. Oh, oh, I shouldn't have looked at the chat then. And I've got an interesting one going up tomorrow. It's all ready and set and scheduled, um, which is looking at that weird, weird penalty that I got yesterday where somebody hit me off and then I got the penalty for hitting them off um, which was really crazy um, yeah really really crazy penalty and in fact the game awards me a penalty and it changes a description which is something I've never seen before so the penalty value stays the same and one minute I get uh, a penalty for one thing and then the next moment I get a penalty for something else it changes about a second afterwards so my take from that is that the penalty system is messed up so Galactical ran out of fuel why are you guys all running out of fuel? This has really got me confused. Because I am... I've got, I've got loads of fuel left. I didn't actually look to see how much I had at the end there, but I certainly haven't got any full warnings coming up. Um, Technic, let me know when you're back from the loo. Um, and then we'll get going again. Um... Bugger, oh, no, sorry, was texting and driving. Very dangerous, don't do it. No, definitely not, definitely not. Um, oh, did I, oh, did I save Game of Dan? Did I save that one? I don't know which one it was. Um... Hopefully I did. Okay. Um, don't think I can... Okay. Um, yeah, I can't share it until I come out. So, uh, 
bleh. yeah i'll have to try and remember to do that if i have if i haven't shared it by tomorrow morning remind me because i don't keep them for very long um was it the last one i saved oh i don't know that was the one where you and um you and jack were right up the front sparring wouldn't it you came first and second okay i think i know which one it is um okay so john's saying stay friends no worries um right so i'm just waiting for m tech to come back And then we'll get going again. Uh, GT, are you racing, my friend? I'll save it as a friend shared anyway, so you should be able to see it that way. Yeah, Tom's in. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, we've got somebody else coming in. Yeah, I'm going to go. I'm staying friends. Um, just waiting for unfazed. And as soon as he's in, we'll get going. we got enough of us. Eight, eight or nine people is, is enough. More than enough for a, a, a decent race of this type. Uh, and if it helps some of us to get better result on Friday, then it's worth doing. Um, I'm probably going to put the, um, the lap time split thing on on this one just so that i can see so hopefully i won't run into anybody um i'm just waiting for mtech to grab a car M Tech, you grabbing a car? Is M Tech racing? Amazing. Jesse, thank you for the mit thank you for the light, Mitch. By the way, do I say your name is Jesse or Jess? I've I've seen a few people pronouncing it differently. Uh, Drac, I'm leaving it as friends for the moment because we've got enough of us in here, um, and I want to keep it nice and respectful if we can while I'm trying to learn. I don't want people bumping me off and everything else. And if we've got nine people, that's a half decent race. Um, Which do you prefer, my friend? JJ. Oh, I'm happy with JJ. Oh, rock on. Rock on. Right. Going to use the uh, Shumi's trick. For a quick getaway. Then I'll make a difference that. saying that. I'm still getting munched by Dowie who's managed to get up the inside of me. Whoa, Jenky and Carlos getting a bit of a door bang through there. Just had to back out of that one. I was on a vortex of doom. Vortex of danger, vortex of death, whatever you want to call it. Door was always going to be closing on me. Yeah, 
Yep, you got it, Drac. Use the handbrake. I've got the handbrake mapped to one of the paddles, and I can let go at the um, the paddle, and away we go. It's so much quicker to release your finger than it is to release your foot. I never realised it. Of all the years I've been doing this. Oh, that's a bit great. That's a bit bad. So I'm really lucky with this wheel, the fact I've got four paddles on the wheel. So I've got one of the lower paddles uh, mapped to the uh, handbrake. And you just watch the lights as soon as those lights go out. Let go of your fingers and you're away. No messing around with your feet. God, these two boys in front are having a battle and a half. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Jenky, I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, JJ. Map it to one of the spare paddles and it's it's amazing. It's brilliant. I often used to get mugged off the line. Now, not so much. Our reactions are still way too slow. It's going to be really interesting, the people that um, aren't going to practice this. There's a lot of people that normally turn up to these sorts of races and they haven't really, they just jump into the race and just go for it. So it's going to be really interesting to see who does that and gets caught out on that little bump. I'm getting to like this one. It's it's uh, I'm having to learn it. I really haven't done anything on it. If you go tighter, you don't hit it. Oh, the wall on the exit. Okay. I've just got to study the lines. I also need to study your notes that you did earlier on. I haven't really had a chance to really get into them. Too deep again. Need to catch the apex. Need to break earlier and turn earlier. I'm trying to carry too much speed in at the moment. Good evening, Clark. How are you doing? too fast into that one as well. I broke about 20 foot later than I would normally on that one. Oh my gosh. Okay, that wasn't very clever. Last corner, really aggressive on hugging the apex. Yeah, you can jump right across the grass on there. I saw a few of the guys earlier. down here on the stewards get it turned 
over the black bit. Oh. Yeah, I'm just going to have to work on this. It's all right, it's just going to take some learning watching a few of the quick lads videos and learning from them Yeah, JJ, and it's those little tips and tricks that I've got to learn from people. Oh. Bit too much on that one that time. This is no one of these slow in, fast out style of tracks. What's up with Dowie? He's all over the place. I'd love to know if the quick guys change down on that corner. Changing down to third across that black bit really seems to work for me. But I don't know if that's the right thing to do. So after the bridge crossing on the right hand turn before the long straight, orange barrier on the right side is where you let off the throttle, no braking. So no braking or changing down gear through there. Okay. I'm assuming Speedy ran out of fuel. <laughs> no, no, just let off, then it's learning when to press the throttle. Oh, really? Okay, we'll give that a whirl. We'll give that a whirl. Well done, Welsh boy.
sort of lap times Welsh ball again. 2.19. And he's in the Sylvia. Well done, Welsh boy. Well done. Don't worry, Greg. I'm struggling too, my friend. <laughs> it's all... It's all about the learning. It's all about learning. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and work on after the bridge crossing on the right hand turn before the long straight. There's an orange barrier on the right hand side. You need to let off the throttle. No braking. No braking, no change in down gear. Just wow. Just coast around the corner. I don't do settings either. Welsh boy, I always mess my car up whenever I do that. Whoa! I'm a sandwich. Ham and a sandwich. A car on the outside, car on the inside, nowhere to go. start without you it's only a short race we'll be back so there's an orange bit on the outside lift there and then we're into the wall how did that work what gear are you going around there in JJ Is that just understeer straight into the wall? Well, I lifted on the little orange bit on the right hand side. When that hit the edge of my screen, which when I lifted. So you're saying I didn't lift early enough? So predict the orange barrier. So possibly as soon as I see the orange bit. See what happens then.
I still think the third that helps me to get a bit of rotation through there, but I don't know if that was quicker or slower. We'll see. Trouble is, I'm not consistent around the rest of the lap to be able to see whether that makes a big difference or not. I to check the replay. At the moment, I don't care about the rest of the track. It's that one corner that I want to focus on. Uh, the rest can come later. Just take it one corner at a time. Really try and focus on that one corner. I went through it in fourth. Get over to the right, up into fourth. Ah, oh, sliding that time. You've got to wait until the car sets. Once you get the car set, then you can get back on the power, but it's waiting, waiting, waiting until the, the car finds its own balance, sets itself, and then go for it. See, I'm learning, not quickly enough, but I am learning. Thanks, JJ. First corner's fourth gear. I haven't studied the gears at all. I'm literally doing just what feels natural for the moment.
That's Seb, Welsh boy's doing a 219 and I'm down in the 225 so it's woefully slow everywhere I would think. It's in the barrier. boy you are lying 10 seconds ahead <laughs> John what car you're, you're in the Veyron Try, um, have you got a different car maybe get yourself a Sylvia spec R Yeah, JJ, it's um, it's one of the things I need to do is just work on each corner. Pick a corner, get it right, do the next one, get it right, do the next one, get it right, put them together, do the next one, get it right, do the next one, get it right, do the next one, get it right, put all of those together. And that's the only way that I can do it is by doing it and doing it and doing it and doing it and doing it. And doing it. I've worked out it takes me between three and four hundred laps to get my optimal time. Um, yeah. Right, are we all ready this time? We all seem to be in. Why did it start without a few people last time? I don't know. Um, right, let's go again. Uh, Speedy, are you gonna are you gonna change your car or are you gonna stick with a Veyron? Uh, the Ferrari is quite good. It's quite a nice car. <laughs> Technic, I think that crash may well have been me. No worries, John. Um, one of the best ways of saving fuel is to change up early. Incidentally, ah, you're in the Veyron. Where are you changing up in the Veyron? Whereabouts are you changing up, my friend? Okay, that should be fine. Yeah, he's changing at the right time. When you're going downhill, try and change about 50%. See if that makes any difference. Uh, where are we up to? 10 races. We've just got somebody else joined. Uh, right, let's, um, let's get this one underway. See what happens. Mediums technic on this one, but you'd have to be on mediums because I think I've got it fixed at mediums. Pretty sure I've got it fixed at mediums. We're just doing the sprint race over and over and over and over again just to try and get some handle of the track. And I am going to have to call it a night soon. I didn't realize it's quarter past one. I've got to be up for work in the morning. Going to this corner for the first time is a bit hairy too. Some of those guys are not breaking to the 50 meter ball. Whoa, game of Dan going round. side of Jenky. Sorry Jenky.
that of Avon's quick down here. Right, let's get on the back of Jenki. Jenki is the car that I should be racing in this race. Getting a 2.22? What tyres was that on? Oh, got my gears wrong there. Oh, that wasn't good. Yeah, but what tyres were we on, Captain? Because 222 seems awfully quick. Welsh boy's only doing a 227. That seems an awfully quick time. I would love to stub D your replay. you get in that speed a Welsh boy's just done a 219 Reiki I'm on 232 I'm 10 seconds behind you ouch I got a lot of time to make up Got a lot to learn.
Oh man. Sometimes I get the corner, sometimes I don't. Same with this one. Oh, okay, I need to, I've got to sit down and, and study the faster laps. Okay, down to the bridge needs to be more smooth. Need to work on my line through there. Sometimes when you hit that bump, as Drac was saying, you can do a little twitch on the steering wheel and you can get through it. I've lost that little knack at the moment. Obviously I'm going through a slightly different line. Turn in later, okay. Ooh, right. I am going to call it a night there, guys. Um, unfortunately, because it's a lot later than I had expected and I've got uh, I've got to be up in the morning. Uh, but you've given me, certainly JJ and a few others, give me a lot to think about in there. And um, I'm going to need to look at some of the replays and just see how people are doing. Um, I've got Jack Kobe's got some nice replays that I've saved and Welsh boy right there. I'm going to save that one and um, just have a look th at what they're doing and just see how we're doing. So, yeah, at the moment you've got uh, Welsh boy with a 219.5. Uh, if I can get a, if I can get a sub 220, I'll be really, 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 really happy. Really happy. Um, Jenky's in there at 222 and I should be doing a similar time to Jenky. I often put Jenky down as one of my bench, one of my, my benchmarks to try and beat. Um, and I'm a 2.25.4. So I'm two and a half seconds off of Jenky. A lot of time to make up. Um, so JJ thinks I can easily do a do 20. That's nice to know. It's just going to take me a little bit of time to get there. Right. Okay. So, um, guys. Um, I'll have a look and see what tyres people were using there. Um, but guys, thank you ever so much for racing with me. I hope that last little bit where we were practicing was useful. I'm hopefully going to do that throughout the week because we're going to be doing these races on Friday. I am currently at the top of the tables and I'd like to try and stay close to the top if I can as we move into a couple of tracks that I actually quite like. Um, but I'm loving the learning curve and the way that Jackie is encouraging me to learn these additional tracks. And it's also making me think about my my learning process on how I'm learning these tracks as well. Anyway, good luck. Good night. Have a good day. 
uh good evening good night whatever you're doing smack the like button if you haven't already and i'll see you at nine o'clock tomorrow night hopefully or sometime after that for now take care bye